and and welcome 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 hi okay okay can i do this now because you guys are just gonna get a black screen for a second and then <gasps> hi chat how's it going oh how are you guys all doing today you guys all doing good oh man today we're gonna have a fun day thank you dylan for the like the 20 year ones thank you so much thank you uh the title there we go I, it should be updated i think right hopefully hi everyone and welcome Welcome to um, what you guys wanted me to do for a little bit. Um, we're going to be a reaction streamer today, where basically what we do is we have other people make the content. No, I'm kidding. Um, that's is technically what it is. That's what react streamers do. But that's okay. That's okay, because I'm going to be adding my own comedy to the mix. Um, keep in mind that I am feeling absolutely terrible today. So I will be extra funny for you guys. Um, we will be we will be good. We will be good. So we're going to be reacting to a little thing called uh, BuzzFeed Unsolved that you guys wanted. So, um, yeah, that's what we are going to do. I'm in a little a little incognito tab to watch this because it's apparently a little spooky. Um, yeah, yeah. But yeah, so that will be that will be cool. That will be awesome. We're going to have fun. And yeah, we're gonna we're gonna do we're gonna we're gonna have fun with this. So basically, I'm just gonna react to it and everything because you guys wanted me to. And also, in case you don't know, I'm doing this little um this little horror series thing. So I thought, hey, unsolved mysteries. That's kind of what I'm wanting to do. Thank you, Bear, for the ten tier ones. Thank you so much. Thank you guys for all the subs today. Really, thanks. Thank you. Thank you. Let's wait. Let's keep on. Oh, there's just no music. Wait one second. <laughs> there is there is just no music. Wait. We'll put on we'll put on a little a little background music just during this part. Um but yeah, that's what we are going to be doing today. Welcome Tommy Raiders as well. Now, it's me, the person from the stream that was happened last time. Pog? Hi everyone. Um we're going to be watching, we're going to be watching something cool. We're going to be watching something cool. It's going to be it's going to be fun. It's going to be fun, I'm pretty sure. So spread the good news. Rombu is now is now live. Rombu is now live, so that's cool. And welcome Tommy Raiders as well. Make sure that you follow and if you have a sub as well, you you can because I I'm going to use it to buy VHS equipment. I'm going to use it to buy old VHS equipment. So so hand over your primes and I will convert them into into 80s media. Yep. 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 <laughs> oh man. Oh man. Hi everyone. Welcome again. Hope that you guys are all having a good day. Thank you, Delirium, for the five ones. Thank you guys. Thank you guys so much for all the support. Um, again, sorry if I'm a little silent or off today because I I'm just like not feeling too good. I don't know what it is, but. It's not, it's not any diseases, thankfully. <laughs> Let's hope. Um, <laughs> but yeah, um, the hype train, I don't know what it's at. 12,600%? Thank you guys, what? Okay, cool. Thank you for the, for the 12,000% hype train. All right, all right. It's time to go, it's time to go, everyone. How long has it been? We have got eight minutes into the stream. Notifications should have gone out. Um, yeah, that's a cool hype train as well. Thank you guys so much for all the support. Really does mean a lot and everything. Um, yeah, make sure that you guys subscribe if you if you want to. If you want to, of course. Do you have COVID? No, I don't. I don't have COVID. Ah. It's time. It's time to go, everyone. It's time to go, I think. So basically what this series is, to my knowledge, is it's just it's just two good it's just two two dudes doing doing spooky things. That is all the information that I got. So we're gonna add a third um, omnipresent dude to the mix that constantly heckles them. Um, that is me, I am the omni, um, omni, omniscient being? I don't know how to pronounce that word, but I hope that I pronounced it correctly. And if I did not, do not make fun of me on any websites or else I will not do anything because I love Twitch TOS. All right. How many episodes are we gonna watch? I do not know. Thank you, Dylan, for the 20 tier ones. I think that was 20. I do not know. I cannot tell, honestly, but thank you so much. I hope that you are doing very, very well. Okay. 
let us do this thing now i think we're good um let me know i well actually no i can see how the volume is so i don't need you guys to tell me i'm i'm becoming um i'm becoming what is the word independent there we go ah uh, okay it's time to go everyone it's time to it's time to start we're starting with in case you didn't see the title the demonic goat man's bridge we're starting off with that one also thank you to um sneeg thank you sneeg for um for giving me the good episodes to watch so thank you sneeg for that so yeah 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 all right let's do this thing now i think thank you granny for the 10 tier ones thank you all right it's time to go i think dude i'm so <laughs> I'm so nervous. I will turn I'm gonna be this nervous well. with a beautiful sunset like that. I immediately press the pause button. This is going off to a great. This is going off to a great start. Because I know it sits underneath it. Uh -oh. Nighttime darkness and demons. I hate demons. Hey. Oh, jeez. Okay. Just starting off it's with the bridge. This. Yeah, I can see that. It's the bridge. There it is. Spooky bridge. Ready? Yeah. You go first. Thank you, Bellin. And he's dead. Dead. I'm on. Gone. Oh, hey, two for two. How also you dead. You did it. Both of them. Gone. Dead, actually. I'm going Here to turn are. it down just a tad. There we go. Thank you, Dylan, the Axolotl, for the There's 50 tier ones. Thank you so much. That have happened to people hey, here. thank you so much. Very sturdy. So now That's that good. It's sturdy bridge. I guess I should tell you why this bridge is what it is. Uh-oh. Tell me. Do you even look just a little bit worried, or do you have to? Never mind. Don't That's do a that. good worried face. Oh, oh, we have an intro. This week on BuzzFeed Unsolved, we investigate. We have an intro, bridge, everyone. AKA the Goatman's Bridge, as part of our ongoing investigation into the question: Are ghosts real? Yes. However, tonight, they this are. bridge and the woods that lie beyond it are I have one. His name Charles. More Charles the Ghost. Demons. Lives yeah, in my house. It's a demon. As I've stated before, I will only do one demonic investigation per season, so behold Aww. this season sacrifice i'm gonna do so many demonic investigations chat you don't even know oh my goodness so so many so many demons honestly a, a good amount at least four uh, do you even like sitting on this bridge do you not like no i don't like it so let's just get it over with you've got a glazed look in your eye yeah i'm fucking nervous man i feel like i'm gonna vomit <laughs> <laughs> God. i love it in 1884, <gasps> Old Alton Bridge was built oh, no. in Denton, Texas to okay. connect the town of Alton to Denton. Alton was a tiny town that originally consisted of one person when it was a That is not a town. That is a glorified mansion. One person? That is a glorified mansion. That is not a town. <laughs> how, do you, how do you call that a town? Thank you, Dylan. How, do, how could you call that a town? I'm sorry, I'm going to be pausing it throughout, I think, to make funny comments, but I'll try not to do it as much. Here we are. It's established in 1848. Snow Chester, touche. Eight. Those were the days <laughs> when one person could land somewhere and say, yeah. this is a town now. He's law and order. <laughs> Welcome He's to Shaneberg. <laughs> to Shaneberg. We're all assholes here. None of us believe in ghosts. Yeah, yeah, Population yeah. Population me. I do. It was chosen as the legal center of Denton County. After the county seat was moved to Denton, residents of Alton <gasps> moved to other... Notice how they said county seat because there's only one, because it's one guy. It's one guy. Sorry, I'm, I'm not going to pause it. I'm not going to pause Alton it. eventually disappeared. Today, <gasps> the bridge is no longer usable for vehicle crossing, but lucky for us, the bridge is available for pedestrian crossing. Lucky oh, no. for us. I don't know why I phrased it lucky for us. That... <laughs> I think I was feeling brave when I wrote this. Yeah, this isn't Thank lucky you, for you at all. No, if, in fact, I kind of wish this bridge was torn down like Alton. But that's the thing about this bridge. No one knows why there's this specter of darkness, like, just sitting on it. Oh, you mean the, why the demon is here? Yeah. I'm going to try and avoid saying demon Yay! as much as I can. At demon? Least, you think not, a demon not, hears the word demon? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not going to let you goad me into this. I know what you're trying to do. Goat you into this? Shut up. We're moving on. We're moving I on. I get it. You know I what? already, I get it. I get it. Applause break for that one. That was a great one. Applause kind break for that one. All right, you, let's keep on going. I got a bad feeling about this one. Shut up. I do. <laughs> it's okay. I came prepared. What are you prepared with? Oh, you'll see, man. 
<laughs> just pulls out a gun. <laughs> this! I'm gonna shoot him. Why are you unbuttoning your pants? Ah! We're in public right now. What are you doing? Shut up. Oh, Ryan. <laughs> what? You've outdumbed yourself. You know, I thought this was gonna be funny, but it I was right! I was right! It was a gun! <laughs> I was I was correct. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> oh, it's my demons. It's my demons. Now I'm actually happy that I have it. Holy water oh inside here. Oh my god. It was holy water. Like I could be Wow. Like, hey Jane, look over at those bushes and then like a demon sneaking up on me. I'd be like, "Hey, Shane, look over there in the bushes." Don't try, demon. I'll fucking pull it out like that. Ooh, that's spooky. Yeah. Obviously. We didn't travel all the way down to Texas to observe a simple old bridge. What brings okay. us to Old Alton Bridge is the meaning of its nickname, the Goatman's Bridge. Goatman's there Bridge. There are several legends mm. of bridges acting as gateways to another realm, and perhaps this bridge is one of them. Oh, those that's gateways. so cool. This bridge and the surrounding woods are said to harbor a dark Ooh, entity. That guy's running around. It's Earl. No. Goat and Earl, man. get back in. The goat man oh, hello. is said to have, quote, glowing empty eyes, end quote. Hey, he's not the only horns. one. Am I right? The reason for this entity's existence has many iterations. One common story is that Satanists have carried out rituals on the bridge that opened the door for Who this hasn't? demon and perhaps others. There is like records of people practicing rituals in this forest and on the bridge. Yes, people like you. How am I the same as a Satanist? Because you believe everything they believe. Yeah, but I respect <laughs> it. I stay away from it. That's There's the two opposite. sides of the same coin. Yeah, and you just got to decide which side you're on. I am the whole other coin. Which coin would that be? Uh, just like a, just like a chill ass wheat back penny or something. <laughs> Another popular story is that a successful African American goat farmer was goat farmer. on this bridge oh. by angry clansmen, oh, no. returning from the dead as the goat man. However, this version of the story is impossible. Oh well, thanks no for giving me hope. No record of this goat farmer even Impossible. Existing. And furthermore. Demons are preternatural. Why would you tell me the theory just to just let me know that it's impossible? Do you think Father Thomas ever watches these videos uh, and is disappointed in you? If these places you're going claim to have spiritual attachments, I would do nothing to invite them to somehow show themselves or taunt them in any way. <laughs> Could you imagine if I did this? I would do the exact opposite of whatever that guy says. I would just, I would just, I would just say, Yo! What up? <laughs> How how are you doing on this fine day? <laughs> Have you considered something other than a bridge perhaps? I would I would be the worst. I would get killed immediately. Once again, I would love to be in a horror movie, but you just know that I die first. That's my thing. You know, that's what I want to do. Thank you, Dylan, for another 25 tier ones. Thank you so much. Perhaps. Probably. Perhaps. I kind of directly disobeyed him in terms of communicating with ghosts and spirits and entities <laughs> and doing it for the, the betterment of the science. Are you going to ever visit him again and show him what you've done? Yeah, I think I would. Like, for instance, if something happens to me tonight, I'll go back to him to get a blessing to cleanse myself. You're going to need Amen. to cleanse yourself. But tonight, <sighs> we're not here to find out why this demon exists. Our goal tonight is to make contact and hopefully capture evidence of this elusive and dangerous demon to prove that it's real. We can okay. only hope that evidence doesn't come at a great cost. <laughs> Your left toes. <laughs> only the left one, those. Th those, though, that Any though. demons here? You more Got any the demons out thing. tonight? Any horny boys or whatever they <laughs> horny boys? They got horns. <laughs> Let your presence be known. Say something. Why are you on this bridge? Okay. <laughs> you ask questions. Why are you on this bridge? <laughs> goat man! You feel goat that? man. You feel the goat man energy? I don't like I feel the goat man energy. energy. Goat vibes? And you may not like my... this. I'm going to try and agitate it. Agitate it. Go, go. You do what you got to do, and I'll do what I got to do. I'm just going to be as crude as possible here. Cool. Yeah. Fuck you, goat man. Yeah. Shit, Is that dude. good? <laughs> I thought you were going to build your way up. Don't... No, no, no. I'm just right out of the gate. Why build up? If you don't believe, <laughs> then you, there's nothing for you to be afraid of, right? You could be as big a prick as you want. I'll I guess stand I over can. here. Goat man, I'm dancing on your bridge. It's my bridge now. Yeah. You hear that? If you want me off this bridge, you're going to have to kill me. 
You're gonna have to throw me off this bridge yourself. You did throw somebody off the bridge once. Look at the way I dance on it. I disrespect your bridge, goat man. He's taking aim right now. You hear that, goat man? He's you sharpening his little blade. Nara, own your bridge. I don't. No, don't loop me into your shit. Stop looping me. I hate when you do this. Well, then tell him. Tell him you're not part of this. I'm not part of his little debate. You're talking to goat man now. I see what you've done. It's goat man and trapping. Goat man. I'm not with you. They're gonna put my name in graffiti. Okay. Children will come here and tell tales of No me. ads! No, no free advertisement. No free advertisement. No free advertisement for you guys. What the heck? Don't worry, I'll switch to my premium account after this because I don't want ads. I didn't realize that there would be ads because it doesn't show the little yellow line. It, it gives me a false sense of security, then proceeds to spit on me. It's terrible. Ah, sub goal. Thank you, guys. Let me change that real fast. I will. I will change that real fast. I don't have any. I don't have anything for it. So I will just. I will just. I will just put it up to a a higher number. And if we hit it, I might do something. I might scream. I might. I might just scream. And that's okay. Sometimes it happens. Sometimes you scream, and you know nothing. Nothing is there to hear. Jesus Christ. We're not going to do that. Actually. <laughs> 75k haircut oh yeah that's still going that's that's definitely still going okay beep boop we're back we'll have reported a growling voice telling them to quote get off the bridge get off and the bridge one person said that after he and his friend heard the voice he ran off the bridge while his friend stayed he then reportedly watched his friend get dragged towards the railing of the bridge and flipped into the water below. People have <laughs> reported not good. hearing hooves following them across the bridge. <laughs> it's just some guy in clogs. Off. It's said <laughs> that the goat man can be conjured by knocking three times. <gasps> the Are they gonna knock on the bridge? Right, oh, I'm man. excited. God damn it. Talking to the goat man. Opening up a line of communication. Gonna... Father Thomas would be very disappointed. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> I'm gonna murder you. <laughs> I'm gonna knock on your bridge. Knock on the bridge. <laughs> now it said that when you do that, you can see his glowing eyes. Oh, what a load of horseshit. <laughs> Someone said they saw him standing on the... Any goat men? Any, any goat men around here? All right, idiot, it's your turn. Knock on the bridge. Knock no, on the bridge. I my hand ready on my pistol. Knock on the bridge. Oh, skip the theatrics and just go into it. Oh, knock on the bridge. Yeah. <gasps> Ooh, spooky. You know, if you want me off your bridge, you're gonna have to throw me off. <laughs> oh, oh, that was Kara. <laughs> I'm so stupid. <laughs> I was just like, oh, two glowing lights. Oh my God, it was a car. I'm an idiot. <laughs> I, I, I saw it and I was just like, yo, oh my gosh, it was a car. <laughs> or was it? Ooh. All right, we'll come back for you. Let's go into the woods. Oh. Into the woods. We'll back, Into After the all, woods. This is our bridge now. Okay. That's how you get them, though. I don't know. That's not how you get them. Shut up. You gotta admit, that's an effective no, technique. No, it's not an effective technique. It's a way to get killed. <laughs> He's probably getting upset, though. This is he? a serious thing. <laughs> Perhaps more foreboding than the bridge. This is a is serious the thing, man. Lies beyond it. it is rumored <gasps> that for nearly a century, people okay. have disappeared near the bridge or mm. in the surrounding woods. That's not good. In addition to the goat man, okay. people have reported seeing the ghostly figure of a woman Ooh. and hearing a woman's voice or laughter. Oh, no. There's also been sightings of strange lights. <laughs> Jesus Christ, like a, dude. Like a car. You walked into a dark wood. <laughs> Never. Never gone camping or anything? You're going on a I night mean, hike? I'm sure, but I haven't gone into a demonic woods before. I want this to. This is so much scarier than hunting fucking Sasquatch. <laughs> and not Earl. And not... I need to make that very clear. Not Earl. Hello? Is there anything out here? Hello? Well, people usually feel overcome with emotion in here. Like a... Like a violent uh -oh. emotion. Do, do you feel that? No. Okay, good. Not yet, at least. Well, give me a heads up if you start to feel murderous. <laughs> yeah, I would appreciate that. 
these woods are rumored to be the site of satanic rituals, attempting to conjure okay. demonic entities. One paranormal investigator claimed to find animal oh, remains that were possible ew. evidence of sacrificial rituals. In fact, one local policeman <laughs> told us that pet stores around the area stopped selling cats due to the amount of sacrificed no! cats being found in these woods. Oh my God! By the way, these woods are also scary because of the people that may be in there. Oh, that's I mean, terrible. Are threats than demons or That's ghouls, actually so, terrible. Yeah, I can't fight. You can't fight. Okay. I got a lot of limbs that are very, uh... No, you you're know. like one of those car wash blowy things that's out front just yeah. wiggling around. I've that's been scary. described but as the same thing. Fight. If you see this in the middle Don't of the, worry. Night, the woods coming toward you, that's scary. No, it's not. Yeah. I'd be like, that guy's whacked out of his mind. <laughs> you would not, yeah, you would run away. I guess. Hello. <laughs> Welcome to my woods. Seals on Mazdas. <laughs> <laughs> Is there anybody out here? Any cultists? <laughs> Anyone doing uh, any any cultists? That's such a weird question to ask. Just uh, I mean, all right. Up to no good out here. <laughs> Anyone cutting a cat's head off? Yeah. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ! Oh, no. One of these we're gonna die. You think so? Yeah. You hearing some over there? Yeah. Thank you, Katie, for the tension. Oh one. shit! Thank you. Oh. There's Wait, what? What is, I don't know what, what is it? What is it? What is it? Bushes <gasps> are moving. Bush just oh! Moved. Ghost activity. Hello? Hello? Ghost activities, any, everyone. Any Hello? and everyone. Oh, God. I did see that bush move. What's that? <gasps> did you hear the scream? Mm, yeah. A scream. It's getting spooky. Oh, God, my mind's starting to melt. I did see that bush move. Oh, jeez. I did see that bush move. Oh, Hello? what the heck? Who's okay, out Okay, that here? actually gave me goosebumps. What? What the heck? Wait, no, 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 no! This just, is supposed to be. Um, this is supposed to be funny. Make oh it no! Seem like we're in on it. What do you mean? We're we're here for the cult stuff. <laughs> oh, I see what you're doing. Yeah. We saw the ad on Craigslist. <laughs> no. <laughs> that feels an even joke. I'm so fucking scared right now. Oh right, man. Right? <laughs> they wouldn't be hiding in the bushes, would they? Oh sure they would. The cultists, okay. Ryan. I feel like I'm scanning like a, like a madman right now. My eyes. Ooh. I keep collecting spider a webs airy. on my face. And now Don't I'm know what that means. Whoa. Right what was that? I keep collecting spider webs. I keep collecting was there another webs scream? I'm just yeah. letting them accumulate. Well, you are just a giant stick uh -oh. walking around. That's true. Oh, this looks fun. It's an odd collection of branches. That's not good. Like a, like a witch lair. It's a spooky chat. Well, there are spirits in here. This is a little, a little spooky. Are overshadowed by the demon. Or Do the demons, demons like tell them to quiet down? Is that how <laughs> that works? There's like a hierarchy. What was that? Was like a hierarchy. Was that? Was that? <laughs> that sounds like Wilbur. That's just. <laughs> Wait, no, that's just. That's just Wilbur. <laughs> like a hierarchy. That's just Wilbur. <laughs> Wilbur, what are you doing in the woods? Wilbur. That that is just Wilbur. Was that? That is, that is just straight up Wilbur. Who's out there? Someone over there? No, I'm serious. I heard something over there. Put that cat down. <laughs> I heard something over there. I don't know what it was. No! You can't do that! Hello? You can't do oh, that, Shane! Dude. Oh, shit. You can't be doing occult stuff like this. Amen. Dude, what are you night. doing? You're fucking crazy. Hold on. We heard some spooky movement over here. Who's over Ooh. here? Take your cloak off. You need to chill. <laughs> you need to chill out. Hello? Hey man. What? Oh, fuck. It's a plan. Oh. It's a plan. <laughs> we kicked Goatman off the bridge. Yeah. It's ours now. Goatman, are you out here in the woods? Our bridge he's now. He's out here in the woods because he's not tending to his bridge. Okay. Amen. Totally. You know, that's why finders keepers and all that. Finders keepers and all that. Finders oh. keepers and all that. Uh oh. Heard that, right? Who's over here? You think they're just all around us? Oh, this is I getting know, creepier. Oh, they're, they're making it. They're making it spooky it's now. The fuck out. Hello? Hey, if there's cultists out there. Shut the fuck up. I gotta let you know that Cal has a water gun. <laughs> Holy water. I don't like this. I don't like this one bit. We are hearing noise from all sides at this point. It's very Blair Witch. Yeah, let's leave. Multiple investigators have picked up on the name Steve through EVP and Spirit Box. Steve from Minecraft? Guys, it's, it's Minecraft Steve. <sighs> This is this is great guys. I am feeling so terrible. <laughs>
Well, let's keep on going. Sessions. Perhaps the moniker that the goat man or another <laughs> demon is going by. Oh like my god. That's what they do. So they go by Steve. <laughs> they go by <laughs> Steve. Yeah, Steve the goat man. <laughs> Steve the goat man. Are you sure that's just not his... His full name is just Steve Goatman. It's just a guy who lives a block away. No. Right, Steve Goatman. <laughs> Why not pick it like a name that strikes terror, like uh, uh, like Sally? Sally's actually pretty scary. That's a little girl. What's a scary name? Um, uh, Darth 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 Alex Mercifax. Marsolomon. <laughs> Thank you, Haley, for the five Barthazar. Thank you. Barthazar. 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 Is a name. There's a lot of names. It's the other I would Steve choose Tony. Yeah, it doesn't really strike fear. Tony the Demon. No, my dad's name is Steve. No, no ads. No I ads. Ah! Shut up, nerd. This guy is just showing me a car and I hate him for it. All right. We're good now. Brawl, this goat man entity and or the possible other entities uh, that lie okay. within these woods and around this bridge okay. are said to be extremely dangerous and <gasps> physical with those who encounter them. Oh People man. have reported being thrown dragged and struck multiple people have claimed to be scratched three times a reportedly common occurrence in demonic attacks that is symbolic for mocking the holy trinity people have good. also claimed to be overcome with intense feelings of aggression and violence aggression and violence caused by a demon I'm just pointing that out, honestly. In one instance, an investigator had envisioned murdering her entire team of investigators. This is your new favorite thing. Just wink. Spirit box. Yeah. Spirit boxing. You haven't used this on a demon yet. Spirit though. beat boxing. Not. Are you more concerned about that? A little bit more concerned, yeah. This is directly against what Father Thomas would have told you. Told yeah, you to you're do. probably right. It's gonna be loud. It's gonna be loud. Ah, my ears. My ear Central holes. Spirit box is scanning. Through all the different radio channels around. Oh, this is kind of rage. a beat. Every two tenths of a second, they're scanning to a new channel. And it produces white noise. This is a jam. So, conceivably, spirits Yo. can use that to communicate with us, or a demon in this case. Or a demon. And if it's saying this more than sick. one word, it's pretty impossible for it to be radio interference because you it's... got yourself a demon, hands down. I'm, I'm, I'm in on this. It's, it's like dubstep, but this. demonic. Well, fun, so fun dubstep, gimmick. some normal yeah, dubstep. All right. Is there dubstep is the devil's music. Bow, 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 bow. Out here. <gasps> what the fuck was that? It sounded like a demon. It was a guy what beatboxing. The fuck was that? Is there a demon here? Oh, it happened can again. You, can he speak to us? <gasps> I heard that. Is there a goat man here? Wait, this is cool. I sound like goat man, but say your name. <gasps> what? What? Is Steve here? No. What? Her bridge. <gasps> <Here's Steve. laughs> uh oh. That's not good. That's so. Uh oh. Uh oh. Bridge. Steve. Based on the response from the Me spirit and box, Wars? we'll end our investigation by returning to the apparent epicenter of the activity, the bridge. Once there, we'll perform a ritual that I have never done before in my life. Ouija? Oh, Ouija! Got four, it's a blast. I'm sure you did it as like a party Ouija trick. Ouija board. Like trick. You just went down, had a couple brewskis. That'd be fun to play with a Ouija board. It's not a toy. Yo. It's, it's made by a toy company. They I'll, do sell it at Toys R Us. True, true, but it's not a toy. I'm just saying, I'm scared to use a Ouija board in the, the comfort demon of my is home. cracked at Bed Wars. I, I never hate that the sentence. The first time I would ever use a Ouija board would be here. On a demon bridge. On a demon bridge. On a bridge. demon bridge. I'm about to die for the internet. This is a doorway we're opening. I should we're get a spirit box. To everything to come here. This is what we're doing. All right. So protect yourself. I'm going to get a spirit box. A circle around us. You've really thought this out. Oh, I wanted to be as safe as I could. I wasn't going to go into this like an idiot. This is great. I'm going to go to Spirit Box it. and find the demons. Those oh, this is cool. Here. You just rest your hands on it and you kind of let your energy flow through it. What? And then we'll start to move. Granted, every time I've seen someone do this on YouTube, they're like, whoa, and it's moving <laughs> Yeah, but I just don't know how that's going to happen unless something comes out. Should we just say our names in the beginning? Yeah. Do it. This is Shane. So. Oh, Luigi board? <gasps> Yeah. Ooh. And I'm Ryan. Crazy cinematography there. Okay. R. What are you doing? Y. A. N. Very swift. 
I don't think we're going to see movement like that again. Uh, is there anybody out here? Or am I all alone? If you put salt around us, doesn't that mean, like, Goatman can't get to the Ouija board? It would trap him in here with us. Wait, that's true. If he was outside of it when you did it. I don't know. Do you want me to throw the salt away? Give him a little entrance. <laughs> Wait, you blow up by you. <laughs> There's your front door, Steve. Come on yeah. in. What's your name? No. Is it moving? Are you moving it there? I'm not I, moving I it. I can't tell. Is it moving? I'm just sitting. <laughs> it goes to Steve. I'm gonna fucking. First off, I don't even think that's really funny. Your hands are shaking. I know, because I'm like, why is this moving? Hey, you demon fuck. Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> Dropped all the decorum, didn't you? <laughs> I, I wanted to catch him off guard. Oh, oh man. We have an S. We got an S. Yay, they got an S. And this bridge is officially mine. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell legends of me here. People will come here and talk about math. Yeah. Facts. Yeah. F? For a second there, I thought I was going towards G, but now it looks like it's F. F. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, gee. This okay. Well, chance, wow. Wow. That's a that's a transition here, for sure. Jesus. Tell us your name. Wow. But again, you know the deal. I guess if you don't tell us your name, then it's gonna be Shane's bridge. You know what? Fuck it. Throw myself in there. If you don't tell us your name, it's me and Shane's bridge. It's our yeah. bridge now. Oh God, I feel like I've gone to the dark yeah. side. <laughs> I'm enjoying this chat. I'm having a good time. Well, my bridge. <laughs> Ouija boards we got, we got, suck. We gotta close it. We gotta oh, close it. So yes. <laughs> G O O D B I E. Goodbye. Goodbye. Well, Goodbye, goat man. Close shop. See you, know, you later. Things to it on your way out. Well, I'm, now I feel like I've conquered it a little bit. But yeah, yeah same mean things to the goat man. How about that? Just gloat a little bit. Gloat a little bit. A goat a little you. bit. <laughs> well, demons, it's been fun. But uh, sayonara. As we snuff these candles, so too do we snuff you from this mortal world. <gasps> you fucking wimp. <laughs> Jesus Christ, <laughs> sir. Nobody knows why the goat man and surrounding entities haunt this area. Okay. And even though we never had a face-to-face -face encounter, I encounter. don't doubt its existence. Either way, we've once, once again, again opened, opened the, the door, door for a dark entity to enter our lives. There is a small <laughs> faction of my mind that is Number definitely 15. disappointed we never saw him. But I'd be lying if I said I wasn't relieved. Regardless, whether or not the goat man's bridge <gasps> is truly infested will remain unsolved. No! Unsolved? No! Oh man, okay chat, what did we what did what did we what did we think about that one everyone? What did what did we think about that one? How'd you guys like that one? That one was pretty was pretty good. It's it's Shane's bridge now and you know what? Good for good for him. Good for him. All right, let's watch another one, shall we? Shall we chat? All right. Let's see. Let's see. Um. Ooh, this one takes place on a ship. Let's watch this one. Why do I still have ads? This one takes place on a ship, everyone. Shut up. Shut up about your search engines. I could. I couldn't care less, honestly. Okay. The Haunted... Okay, now we are going to be watching, chat, for the second episode in Rombu's Spooky Show Night. We are going to be watching The Haunted Decks of the Queen, Queen Mary. That's what we are going to watch. So we shall, we shall see what happens on today's episode of The Haunted Decks of Queen Mary, Season 1, Episode 1, and also the only episode in the series about about the the queen mary all right all right all right let's do this thing this is let me move this there we go this is where we're sleeping tonight. it's already spooky oh wait 
most haunted places ah, in the world that was as loud. part of our ongoing investigation to oh. answer the question, are ghosts real? Yes. Right now we are sitting in the Queen Salon of... Oh, this is cool. I love abandoned the ships. boat in the world. Abandoned ships are awesome. To the Queen Mary. Queen Mary. Rude to call it the creepiest boat in the world. It's a I mean, that's not an unfair statement, would you say, right? It's a queen. marvel. It's a marvel. The Queen Mary. Woo! Look at that. Look Apparently at that. This boat is two times the size of the Titanic. Captions? Thank you, two chat. Times? Thank you for letting me know that those happen. Thank you. Two times. All right. <laughs> Titanic's <laughs> tiny. That's not true. <laughs> it's true. All you two need times to know the size of Titanic. The size of the Titanic was like what? Like, and, uh, I don't well, know what it was. Here I am. You're not a man of your word. I don't know what it was. You know, thank you for the six sunset, months, though. and There's thank you, Jocelyn, for the prime. In, thank uh, you. In today, it's that nice sunset. Enjoy it, Ryan. It's the last Ooh. one you're gonna see. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is cool. Well, I'm back. He's back. <laughs> that is, that is that. Do you feel like it? This reminds <laughs> me of the Titanic. Good job, I chat person. Hope not after what I These are both ships. Last time I was here. What did you do? You'll find out. Ooh, a captain. You mean that you think there's something about Mary. That Indeed, yeah, that's exactly. She might be a little bit enchanted. Yeah, I think so. You know, that is the dumbest thing I've ever seen. Get off of my ship! I that you have disgraced the name of Queen Mary. How could you ever think demons? Are you kidding me? Get off of my get off of my ship right now! I'm the captain of the ship. I'm 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 kicking you off. I hate you. Goodbye. Leave. How, how could you think that she's enchanted? She's not a Minecraft sword after one lapis and an enchantment table, okay? Now get, now get off of my ship or else I'm going to just throw you off of the ship, honestly. Literally, literally throw you off of the ship. I, I will, I will commit murder. That was a joke. That was a joke on Twitch. I was playing the part of the captain. Um, uh, murder in a video game. When things are so pristine and uh, beautiful like this. All right. But <laughs> vacant, there is something very unsettling to it. I don't know what it is. What do you find unsettling about this? Lots of things. That being said, <laughs> that looks pretty cool though. That, 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 that like space and everything, that looks really cool. I really like that. That's all I have to add to this. Okay. <laughs> Named after Britain's actual Queen Mary, the Queen Mary was completed in the 1930s. Oh. And embarked on its inaugural voyage on May I'm very surprised that they saw the Titanic and they were just like, let's make more ships like this. It served as the new benchmark for luxury containing two cocktail bars, two swimming pools. I would think that boat sails go down after a bit, ballroom, and much you know? However, all that luxury would soon go to waste during World you would, you would think, uh-oh. The ship was repurposed as a transportation vessel for troops and prisoners. That's a lot of, of people. And was appropriately painted gray. Gray. Fact, the ship was so much faster than enemy U-boats that it earned the nickname, the Gray Ghost. It was they faster than- Specifically for huh. the war? You don't think the Gray Ghost is a pretty cool nickname? It is a pretty badass name. Captain yeah, sure. Yeah. Ghost. Tell that story in a bar. Yeah. Oh, my ship? Well, she's called the Grey Ghost. The ship was estimated Ooh. to have carried over 800,000 servicemen throughout the, the Queen war. Mary is no joke, in really? The ship All right. The Queen I know where I'm going. In 1965, <laughs> it was sold to the city of Long Beach in California. One second. I have to make an addition to my notes. One, one second, actually. Go to Queen Mary. Set reminder. Constant. Okay. Awesome. Will do. Yeah. Where it is now docked permanently. Now that we've established <gasps> the boat's history, it was in California. I my own I could have gone there. This ship. Oh God. I've told Shane this story before, but uh, about ten years ago, mm -hmm. when I was, mm, was it ten years ago? This is riveting. When I was What's seventeen years old, I visited oh. this ship with a couple friends. I was really okay. interested in the paranormal, but didn't believe it was a real thing. All right. I never thought I'd be back in this room. This was the, uh... <gasps> What's the room? This was What's my the ghost room? <laughs> After taunting the ghosts to show themselves and coming up empty again, I returned disappointed to my hotel room on the boat. Yo. Cabin B484. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. This hasn't changed one bit. That's exactly Oh, this is cool. Which bedroom? I like this. I was sleeping right here. On this one. I was sleeping on the <gasps> left side towards the wall. We were hanging out. This looks like a best western. That night when I slept, I was repeatedly poked in the face. <laughs> I love that image of just him. I was repeatedly poked in the face. And he's just like, actually, just there's just a guy. There's just a guy just standing over him, just like, <laughs> 
Oh, that's fantastic. And when I finally did to confront the person I was sleeping next to, my friend Elvin, I discovered to my horror <gasps> that he was actually fast asleep and snoring. Oh no. I thought maybe, uh, Ain't that like Elvin? Yeah, maybe nothing. I mean, oh, maybe, <laughs> maybe it was a was dream. Nothing, so I, I, I tried to push. Fun fact, actually, um, last night I had a dream about and warning for a for a pretty um uh intense topic just so you guys know um i had a dream that i legitimately died so i was able to feel what my dream state um it wait what is it i, I was able to feel what my dream state thought was death which is very interesting it was it was a very interesting feeling honestly the way the way that i died was i got like i think i got stabbed I got I got like stabbed and I legitimately felt it. So I actually I actually felt what my brain thinks death is. So that's really cool. Yeah, I, w I woke up today knowing what my brain thinks that death feels like, which is which is awesome, which is absolutely fantastic. I will I will use it. Yeah. So it's like, it, it feels like a, like, it feels honestly like, I don't know. It, it's really, really weird. It feels like a, like a, like a release or something, you know? Oh, it's just, it, it was cool. It was cool, honestly. It was cool to feel what my brain thinks that death feels like. Push through it. I eventually did fall asleep. The next morning, went into the bathroom. My friend Casey saw the sink turn on, so we set up a camera to try and catch that. So when we set up the camera, we actually caught, if you look in the footage at the left corner, felt really weird. there's a bag with toothpaste on top of it. You'll never forget that plastic Ziploc bag. Fuck you. Yeah. I'm getting chills seeing the actual toothbrush that has been so Okay, see, look at it. You can see it. <laughs> Thank you, Queen, for the 5 to 1. <gasps> Queen Mary! <gasps> it all, I missed that. It. What was that? <gasps> what? What? So, look at Wait, it. what? It. It already happened? Yeah, it already happened. That's Both cool. Well, considering I didn't even catch You were it. focusing on the wrong side of the screen. That's, yeah. that's cool. There's force at play there, though. That's very, very One cool. Time. Gravity. <laughs> hey. See it again. Okay, you gotta admit, that looks weird. No? All right, so it really doesn't. Let's rewind it again. It yeah. happens at the exact same time that you throw your shit on the counter. There's always something. Mm -hmm. Look yeah. at the bag, how it moves. It's like... Because yeah, there's toothpaste. Well, yeah, the bag moves care. because it gets well, pulled down, honestly. Stiff. Yeah, I don't. That's firm, gravity, it I think. It looks like someone's puppeteering. Well, yeah, it's because, it's because it like fell. Back. I think it's gravity. You can't I think it's see gravity. That it flung it a little bit. This toothpaste falls straight down. It was up and down. Straight down. Up and down. Okay. Straight down. <laughs> no, up and down. Before that toothpaste hit the floor, <gasps> I didn't believe in ghosts. <laughs> <laughs> What kind of sentence is that? What kind of sentence is that? Before the toothpaste fell on the floor, I didn't believe in ghosts. What what kind of sentence is that even supposed to be? What kind of what is that? Oh my god. Before let's listen to that again. Let's listen to that again. Before that toothpaste hit the floor, I didn't believe in ghosts. I thought this was all. What what the heck? Oh my god. Before that toothpaste hit the floor, I didn't believe in ghosts. But now, after seeing that toothpaste fall on the ground, I'm like, oh yeah, demons sign me up. Yes. <laughs> but what I saw in that bathroom changed me. Into the <laughs> it was toothpaste on the floor. I'm sorry, but it's really not that deep. I'm I'm sorry, my friend, but it is it is it is it is toothpaste on the floor. It's it's really it's really not that deep. One time, I saw my nephew drop a <laughs> drop a ball on the ground, and then it started to roll down a hill. And after that, I believed in Beelzebub. Now today, we're gonna be <laughs> we're gonna be getting this cat and then throwing it into a river. <laughs> Jesus Christ, the Ryan! And the paranormal. I never doubted it again. I... <laughs> the toothpaste really changed his life. There. <laughs> what the heck? The toothpaste really changed his life there. What? That is the funniest thing. That is actually the funniest thing.
Why is that the pin drop for you that makes you believe in ghosts? Why is it toothpaste falling on the floor? I swore I would never oh return my God. to this ship. And yet here I sit. I swore I would never return to this idiot. ship. So I've told you numerous times that I would love to see something like that. If, if I just get one experience like that, with oh brief, my God. Tonight, I'm feeling lucky. That being said, let's explore some of the paranormally active areas of the ship in my return to the Queen Mary. There are quite a few documented deaths that occurred on the Queen Mary. Wow. And numerous more reported ones. Undocumented deaths. Couple. In 1936, okay. Sir Edgar Britton, the first captain of the Queen Mary, died of a stroke mm -hmm. in his cabin. Aww. In 1949, senior second officer... Why does he have no face? ...accidentally drank laundry detergent stored in the gin bottle. <laughs> senior second officer, William... William. That is your legacy, William. That is... That is your legacy, William. I am so incredibly sorry. I am... I am so incredibly sorry, William. That... <laughs> that's, that's your legacy now. William Stark. You could've, you could've done anything else. But you did, you did that. Ah, oh, rip, rip, William. Stark accidentally drank laundry Poor detergent guy. stored in the gin bottle, thereby oh, poisoning no. himself to death. Who's storing that? Poisoning himself to death. <laughs> I, I think, I think you don't need the to death part of that. I, I love, I love, I love his narration so much. <laughs> he was stabbed to death from a knife that killed him in his sleep when he was sleeping when the knife was inside of him when he got stabbed to death. That in a gin bottle, though. Apparently, the captain at the time had a gin bottle in his room, and he said, you know, you've been doing mm -hmm. a good job today. Go to my room, pour yourself a drink. He oh, no. Acid, or I've also heard it was detergent. Oh, oh no. Like Burning my tongue. I better <laughs> swallow it. You imagine him just a minute after the guy left the room. Oh, like, no. <laughs> Oh shit, I hope he didn't no. drink the other bottle with the X's on it. Oh darn it. By the way, Shane, I, I have a bottle of whiskey in the room for you if you want to go take oh, a sip go, of it. Let, let yeah, go, go, get go, that. go. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. However, the most <gasps> unfortunate deaths all occurred at one time. As I The most unfortunate desk, chat. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. No. Not the unfortunate desk. The greatest killer of all. Yeah, that's gonna be the that's gonna be the twist in my horror series chat. It's gonna be the desk all along. I mentioned before, the Queen Mary served as a transportation vessel during World War II. <laughs> On October 2nd, 1942, the Queen Mary was being escorted from New York to Glasgow by another much smaller vessel called the HMS Curacao. Uh-huh. The Curacao was zigzagging in front of the Queen Mary to confuse potential U-boats and German bombers. However, okay. Queen Mary, traveling at 28.5 knots, mm -hmm. unexpectedly caught up to the Curacao. Oh no! Consequently, collided with the ship. Oh the shoot! Curacao in half. Boy, I, how much bigger was it? 20 times bigger. Oh no! Bigger. That just fucking cut through that thing like a oh, hot man. butter patty. <laughs> butter. Your butter patty. patty. Yeah, like a hot butter patty. That's not what it's called. <laughs> like Some a hot butter patty. Some were killed instantly on impact. Oh while wow! Others were thrown into the freezing water. Oh no! Watching as the men who remained on board sank. Trapped within the remains of the vessel. Oh, that's because creepy. Ooh, that I'm getting a little goosebumpy. It, it also might be just from the fact that I feel them up terrible, but that's okay. <laughs> that's all you got to say about that? <laughs> <laughs> Boat yeah. Boats are tough, you know? <laughs> Boats are tough. It's not an easy life. <laughs> Boat life. Due to thank you, Grace, for the tier Captain one. Thank you. Mary, Cyril Illingworth was not able to stop to rescue the passengers. Oh, and they no. Aboard, reporting the incident to oh, nearby British no, that actually sucks. By the time the British arrived, about two hours later, it was too late. Many oh, had already no. died from hypothermia. And of the 430 crew members on board the HMS Curacao, oh, don't go to single. only 99 survived. Oh, or double. You know what, that's okay. Screams of the Curacao passengers no, that's not okay. A lot of people still died. I think for the eight months some as well, claim that you. the bow of the ship is a hot spot. You feel the them vividly in some places? I want to do that. I want to do that now. You guys are making me want to go to a haunted place. Yeah, you're not fucking scared right You guys are making me want to go to a ha haunted place now. Dude, do you have any idea where we are right now? It's a boat. Right now we're in the bow of the ship. Yeah. And now we're in the bow this of the ship. This is where the ship struck the Curacao. We're in her belly. Oh, wow. That's the cargo hold. Ooh. They used to keep POWs. I'm just there. finding this interesting I now. I love the intricacy of how old ships camera. were built and everything. So it's really cool. Here, we may be able to pick up their heat signature. Yeah. Ah. Yeah. Whoa. Jeez, that was a change of color. Whoa. <laughs> My eyes. 
Flashbang. Asking uh, or communicating with ghosts. But uh, I'm okay. really going to be actually an investigator in this. I have to, right? Yeah, you can do it. Go on, Ryan. Do you go on. Talk. You know do it, Ryan. With this boat. Um, you can do it, Ryan. Be direct. I believe in you. Shut up. Shut up. I First believe off. in you, Ryan. Sorry for what I said last time. What did you call it? I called it a motherfucker. I called it a coward. Ryan. Oh and no, said, uh, he spoke bad to the ghost. Bullshit. <laughs> We're not here to hurt you. Oh god. And I think you're not here to hurt me. Though so Ryan is very angry about that toothpaste incident. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> he told me before your we got here. Shut your <laughs> um. <laughs> oh man. Uh, spirits. Spirits. Spirit. Show yourself. Show yourself, no, spirit. Be, what are you doing? You, you said to be direct. Yeah, but don't uh, be Bruce Willis from Die Hard. Spirit. Yo, know, let's yeah, see yeah. if there are any demons in this house real fast. Hey! Reveal yourself. What, what is that? Oh, shoot. Oh, well, okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop looking at the windows now. Jesus Christ. That actually scared the crap. There was some. There was a little something in the there's window. Here, huh? okay. there, was, for some youngsters. Well, there was no a little something in the window. The day, so I was there by myself, and I'm sitting there tapping on the the woodwork next to the porthole, and I thought, well, I'm I'm not kidding. I'm genuine. I see. I see. I see something out there. I wish that I was kidding. There, there is definitely actually. That's not the tree. <laughs> All right, let's. Jesus Christ! All right. Wouldn't it be weird if somebody responded and lo and behold, just on uh -huh. the other side of the wall, I uh -huh. heard somebody go tap tap. Oh no! Oh man! That's of not course. good. Uh, it's still there. It's peeking out from behind the tree. It's scaring the crap out of me, actually. <laughs> it's not the branch. <laughs> oh, shoot. That, that genuinely scared the crap out of me. I... Oh. All right, I'm just gonna keep on scared. going, chat. Well, maybe. No, no, no. No, no. I mean, you could try that. Oh man, is this? I'm just... Oh! That got me. That that scared me because I was looking at it, and then. All right, I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna keep on. Oh, oh no. It's just creaking, that's fine. Oh no. <laughs> okay, we're good. Nothing happened. One second. I'm gonna go. One second. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna go take a picture of it to prove, to prove that I'm not... I'm gonna take a picture of it, okay? Just to prove, just to prove that it's, that it's terrifying. Alright, I'm opening up the door now! Okay! I don't know if that's a good sign. It is not there. <laughs> Gosh darn it, dude. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Fundy, for the 10 tier ones. Yes, yes. Yeah, if you want to get a, sh a shout out to be in the clip of me getting legitimately, it's not there anymore. It's all good. It's all good. Other alleged. Oh, 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 oh
One apparition appears in 1930s clothing okay. and another in 1960s. There is also reports of a little boy who fell overboard near the pool who now haunts the passageway. A little girl named Jackie also is reported to haunt the swimming pool areas. I just think it's embarrassing for them to drown in a pool <laughs> on a boat. That's <laughs> Also, was there no light? Wow! The only yeah, thing that has conquered buoyancy. Wow! They, on top they of really the just—they're really just the roasting yeah. the people that According drowned to the on the boat. Captain, during World War II, a cook died in horrific fashion. Apparently, he was shoved into an oven by Australian soldiers and shoved into an to oven. Death. Wait, 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 wait! What happened? Australian soldiers they had picked up who did not like the food took this chef oh and my uh, God. instead of giving him one star on Yelp, shoved him into an oven. Maybe Cooks that's why they created Yelp. Yeah, yeah, Maybe we're tired of being murdered. Many say his screams can still be heard. Yeah, it was in a glass break a couple seconds ago too. Yeah, did you hear that? Yeah, we are right next to, I mean, down the hall is the galley where the kitchen was. This is terrifying. <laughs> I'm a little unnerved that they- I'm, I'm so cold. The clanking did come from the kitchen. That doesn't sit super well. Oh, Turning wow, off the AC. For once. I think it was the AC. I just got random shivers. Truman was crushed by door number 13. Oh no. Automatically closing door during a watertight drill. His ghost is sometimes seen wearing white coveralls. Looks very confusing. Okay. It looks like it'd be pretty easy to get crushed to death here. I mean, this is just in itself, even if this is not spiritually active. I mean, look at this place. It's a marvel. It's just massive. There's just numbers. How could anyone possibly know what the hell is going on down here? Number 13, is this where- Salt, it's yeah, it's yeah, yeah, um. This is where lubrication happens. Uh-oh. Lubrication oil pump controllers, to be exact. A little semen lubrication. Jesus oh. Christ. What now? No. That's Pardon? Fun. I think this is it right here. <laughs> this is door number 13. Chat, why are you saying salt circle? Do I feel strange right here? Yep, I don't like it. I'm gonna get out of that. I'm, I'm not. Tubbo, were you were you outside by the tree? Outside by the tree. Were you outside by the tree? Well, outside just, at, just now. Yeah, at any point tonight. Yeah. Wait, you were? Yeah. But you were you were behind the tree. I was on the swing. You were on when were you on the swing? When did this happen? Like twenty minutes. Ten ten minutes ago. Um. What do you mean? So, okay, so you see, you see, you see like how that branch like cuts off, right? Yeah. There is genuinely another thing behind that. Wait, there's something behind that tree? There was, there was genuinely something behind the tree. No, dude, stop, you're gonna freak me out. I'm, I'm not trying to creep you out. I, there was gen, I thought there was genuinely something behind the tree. No, dude, you're gonna fuck me up, don't say that. I, I'm just telling you what I saw. Do I need to get like a bat and go swing at it? I've yeah, got, like, go. Still baseball bat. Go, go, swing, my old go swing at it. Go swing at it. Swing at it. No, I don't want to. Come with. I'm not. How how am I gonna come with you? Just leave. The how? Stream. And if you don't come. <laughs> how am I gonna leave the stream? <laughs> there was genuinely something behind there. I Are swear to sure? God. And then and when I when, then when I opened up the door, there was nothing. There was nothing behind. It was like it was like looking out at me. It looked right. It looked like those stumps, right? So that's what I thought it was. But then there was like a third one, like right below it, and then it was a fox. It was. It was halfway up the tree. You're fucking with me. Leave me. Alone. I'm not. I swear. I swear. I am not. I just came in here for an iPhone charger, and you dump your trauma on me. Leave me. No. Please. This is. This is. This is fresh trauma. I don't. I'm this gonna is go fresh and, trauma. Like, fucking die now. So. Uh... Wait, are you actually? I swear there was something behind right, there. Get a floodlight. Give me a second. I'm going yeah, out. get a get a floodlight. I'll record this and then upload it later. Okay, wait. I'm getting my phone. Maybe. This is. <laughs> I wish that I was kidding. I really wish that. <laughs> it is terrible. It is terrifying, actually. All right. I put my torch on my ass. If I don't come back, like call the freaking police. Okay. Sounds sounds good. I don't want to go out there, dude. Go out there. <laughs> Wait, record, record it. I'm not recording it. Record it! So I can use it as found footage when you get killed. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. You're not gonna get killed. I'm sure it was. I'm sure. Oh, I, I, I thought okay, I saw I'm it again. Yeah, run around the tree and then run back. <laughs> I just see him run around the tree. <laughs> what? There's nothing around there, but I thought I was gonna be attacked. 
There's nothing okay. There's nothing there. We're good. It's I've got gone. Really wet socks now. We're good, guys. It's gone. <laughs> I've got like really wet socks now. Oh, the socks have come off. You know what that means? I don't know what. Uh, what? Oh my god. Hey, you told me what that means. No, I I really didn't actually. You got it out of context because your chat is is sinful. Which is pro which is probably this is this is this is punishment for the chat. The living daylights at me. Never I me to go no, I swear to God, again. I am not joking. I legitimately saw something. It was a third. It looked like a third stump My on the side of the tree. So fucking fast right now. It was actually. Oh my god! It was genuinely there. I fill my heart. He's I'm, actually so I'm, fast. I'm, I'm, I'm he is legit, not joking. Like, it is genuinely you so made me fast. Watch it. You made me watch it, and, like, <laughs> and I was at the terminal. I, I swear remember. to God, it was there. I was gonna run around Where's that tree, and the fucking tree. penny dickhead is gonna come grab my neck and put me in this hairy sink. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not cut out for that shit, dude. Do you want to go find a haunted place and record? Huh? Do you want to go find a legitimate yeah, haunted place? I'm not taking my idea earlier. Did you? Are yeah. we gonna? Do you want to do like a? Do you want to do like well, a series? That's where I'm getting an IRL backpack. Do you want to do a? Do you want to do a haunting series? Do you want to do like a haunting series on both of our channels? That sounds cool. But yeah, can I do, do mine live? Yeah, you can do yours live. You, you I'll be do, recorded. I'll be live. I'll do. Well, I'll do one recorded. You can do one live. Twelve hours sleeping in a haunted. Mansion. We are not. We are not sleeping there for twelve. We are not sleeping there for twelve hours. Twelve hours stream sleeping in a haunted mansion. Oh fuck. Oh shit. We are I not. Just, we are oh, not doing I that. Just picked over your glass of water and my panic run back into. No! I kicked over your glass of water. No! Oh, oh god. Do you, do you actually? Because I think it'd be really, really fun. Yeah, we can. I think it'd be but, really, oh really. God, I'm like, going to get so much I'm demonic gonna be honest stuff. With you, like, I'm, I, it, I swear. I'm I swear that it was. I swear that it was there. I feel like you know that. Calm down. When have some. To need a shit, but you don't yet. A dark and, shadowy figure is known as a shadow man. What does it mean when they when they are white? It... I'm going back to watch Adventure Time. Leave me alone. All right, have have I'm fun. Just watching Adventure Time with Ainsley, and you've just, have, you've have just fun. ruined this for me. Have fun with that. But I'm sat in the, I'm sat in the glass conservatory, so I'm gonna. <laughs> <laughs> That's oh so mean. god. Oh. And I was out on that swing earlier. I I don't think that it was you though. That's the thing, because it was, was like. Out on that swing. I am so terrified of that tree kidnapped. now. And you didn't tell me. That's because it was after when you were on the swing. It was it was way after you were on the swing. I don't feel safe in my own house. Uh oh. Can I just sit in here with you? I'm just gonna sit here in the background. You just want to sit here in the background. I'm watching oh. a spooky thing. Oh, you're watching. Spooky. Well, no, I'm watching. I'm watching two dudes on an abandoned ship. Two dudes chilling on an abandoned ship. Um. Okay. And there he goes. All right. It was it was genuinely there, chat. I I <laughs> either that or the the feeling that I have of just like maybe oh boy. It's okay. crazy that of all the numbers you could have gotten stuck in 13. 13. That's the worst one. That's okay, no, the sorry, worst one. Good. Hello there. Uh, if there's anybody here, please show us a sign. Make a bang. Be nice. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's not no. nice. No fucking way, no. It's clearly just some machine turn. <sighs> uh yeah, if that was, if uh no, that's gotta be I, I need to calm stage, down. Right? <laughs> yeah, probably. Or a ghost. D d d please do not donate legitimate advice for handling this. I don't. You're making this more serious than I feel like it. It's gone now, so we're good. We're 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 okay now. We're. we're Jesus Christ. Right now, I'm talking to the gentleman who got crushed in this door. If you're here still. Okay. Please show yourself. Uh, I'm not seeing it. Just, just light bulbs and shit. Not seeing anything. Not seeing anything. Scanning, scanning. Oh shoot! Oh. Whoa. No! 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 <laughs> Simply, no. Simply, 
Jesus Christ. No. What? <sighs> All right. All right. Let's go, everyone. Did you see something? Look at this. It's just a light. It's just a light. But it looks like someone looking out. <laughs> Is that not? Yeah, it does. Holy oh, shit. Oh, that's like terrifying. Human being scared staring at the whole no. shit out of me. Other hot spots on the ship include the engine room, the safe room, the R deck four okay. down storage, okay. the, box, the propeller box, and finally, the isolation ward, where the sick and those diagnosed with a contagious disease were kept away from the other passengers. And in some cases, the isolation ward served as a makeshift prison. Okay. Jesus, bird. Vision looks scared too. Bird. Oh my, <laughs> my fucking heart almost exploded. Oh my god. Your heart on exploded. What? Oh my god. Oh what my god. Floppy. Check that out. Oh man. Let's move on to the final stage of the investigation. Okay. Spending the night on the ship. Spending the night been given on the ship. Ooh. To the most haunted cabin on the Queen Mary. Okay. Cabin B340. I already don't like it. I already don't I already don't like it. I I already hate it actually. <sighs> okay. You're in for a real experience tonight. Isn't it? I don't like you either. I Nope, don't like you. You're really gonna hate this. Yeah, I imagine I'm gonna hate this. <laughs> okay, about to look at this for the first time. You've gotta be fucking shitting me, dude. Are you fucking kidding me? Okay. Oh, no, 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 Ryan, no. Oh, this no. is terrifying. <laughs> no, oh, we gotta no. sleep in here. No. This is where we're sleeping tonight. Yeah. You're gonna lose your mind. Yeah, I'm gonna lose my mind, of course. Okay. Workers that have worked on this ship for Why is it why is it doing this? Cases, they never go in there by themselves. And when I told them that we're sleeping in there, they laughed and told me I was an idiot to my face. Oh <laughs> well, no. So <laughs> that's funny. <sighs> the cabin has reports of voices, beds shaking, water running, and lights being turned on by itself. In fact, Cabin B340 huh? has garnered so many reports and complaints of activity that it was actually shut down and ripped apart about 25 years ago. Okay. Since then, nobody's been allowed to sleep inside. Until oh, tonight. Oh, no. Where we will attempt to sleep inside Cabin B340 for the first time in nearly 25 years. I don't think we've ever attempted something more oh. idiotic than this. Holy... Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. This is a nightmare room. If there's anybody in here... I don't like the nightmare room. ...that wants to talk to us... I don't like the nightmare room. Something. I'm gonna be real? Um, I don't like the nightmare room. If there's... Please, God, no. If there's... If there... Oops. Is that... Did you just fart? <laughs> I did. <laughs> 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 Did my farts? Uh, oh kidding? no! It was an accident. I didn't do that on purpose. Incredible. I genuinely did it not. Just it just slipped. It just Incredible. Slipped. If I see anything at all tonight that that awakes Incredible. me, then I'll join you in and this weird be, little camp. And you'll be me. I'll be you. Man, bed shaking in here. That's gnarly. Oh man. No jokes on them. No bed to shake. Uh huh. Gotcha, ghost. It's an empty all room. All right. It's it's. What is the ghost even gonna do in there? I don't know. Poke me in the face like it did when I was 17. Poke him in the face? Crap, I'm already doing it. I'm starting to psych myself out again. Just oh, no. On how tired you are. Oh, what the fuck is that? Oh. <laughs> Dude, what the fuck is going on? Is there animals fighting? Huh? No, that doesn't sound like animals. It sounds like static. No, those are outside. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. I mean, uh -oh. We tried to sleep at the cell. Oh, okay, they're fine now. They're asleep, back in the little hall. The we're okay now. We're good. You're gonna stay awake I am going to go we're to good, sleep. chat. No, not. If you try it's to wake all me up, okay I'm now. To I'm gonna pour water in your face. You do whatever the hell you want. I'm not gonna acknowledge you. <laughs> you know. What was that? 
What was that? Some bullshit. Huh? Did you hear it? No. Huh? A voice. A voice? A voice? You've somehow tricked me into not being upset that you're still talking, but I, I'm going to go to sleep. I, I'm going to try again. I don't know what you did. He's going to sleep. Okay, we're good. I'm, ang I'm angry. We're again. good. Okay. 7 a.m. You? You just kicked me? Oh, okay. Oh, we're good. What the fuck? Thank you for the hundred bits. Thank you. We're still here. Yeah. Hey. I was stabbed to death with a butter knife. Yay! The room is clear. The room is clear. The room is clear. It's just an empty bare room appropriate for a sitcom exit. <laughs> We've had some fun times in here. <laughs> Farewell to the Queen Mary. Farewell, Queen Mary. You're, be you're a beautiful lady. I love beautiful. Your bones. The prodigal son returned today and uh, they survived. Didn't come back with as much evidence as they last did it, time, chat. What a ship, still. They did it, oh, they survived. And I'm still not prepared to say this place is not haunted because I very much believe it is. So it remains. Wow. The Queen Mary is an 80 year old ship with plenty of rich yet tragic history. Okay. Are there actually ghosts that inhabit the halls and decks of this former warship? Or is that merely part of the narrative? After spending one nearly sleepless night in the ship, I can certainly attest to the fact that the Queen Mary may be haunted. Uh-huh. But as always, the answer will remain unsolved. No! Unsolved again! Let's go on to another one, shall we, chat? Shall we? We shall. We shall do another one, chat. We shall do another one, chat. Oh man, let's do this. Let's do this one. All right, which one should we do? Three horrifying cases. Uh, let's. You know what? Yeah, let's do three horror. It's got. It's got baby dolls in the oh, thumbnail, really so that's always a great sign. It has. It has little little dolls in the thumbnail. This one is forty six minutes long. So buckle up. Get some snacks. Get some. Um, you know, get get comfy, cause cause we're we're in for one. We're in for one. Chat. All right. Get, get nice and comfy. I, yeah, let's do this thing. All right, chat? How's the tree doing? The tree's doing great. All right. Let's, let's do this one. All right. This one's so good. I hope it is. I hope it is. Let us do this one, chat. It's time to go. Chester. This is a ghost town. We're going to mix good. Terrifying island of the dolls. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, oh, I already hate it. I already, I, I already... I already hate it. This is... This is great. This is absolutely... And fantastic. Am I right, chat? We love this. We love this, chat. And the trip. What the fuck was that? Oh, okay, <laughs> Jesus Christ, we don't. We don't. Oh, what? Okay, I'm gonna stop pausing now. Nope. <laughs> Today on BuzzFeed Unsolved, we I don't like this one. And visit some of the most haunted, horrifying oh, places in the world no. in an effort to answer some questions that I've always been curious about. What questions, are Ryan? And real? And if they oh. are real, can they manipulate, harm, and perhaps even kill the living? Oh, uh, right now, in San Jose, California, oh God! Our church to talk uh -huh. to Father Gary Thomas in 2005. Father <gasps> Thomas. Father Gary the Thomas. The Yo. A movie was actually based on his experiences in Rome, starring Anthony Hopkins. Oh, that's fantastic! He's the real deal. We're gonna be happy that we talked to him and had his guidance when we go to. That's some of these great. Places. Yeah, good for so. you, we big better, we better guy. You, you nice. Here, otherwise, we're gonna get murdered <sighs> by ghosts. You're gonna be thankful that we're meeting this guy. Amen. Later, I promise you. I promise Aww. you, you will regret that statement. Oh no. I don't want to regret anything. I want to live life with no regrets. I want to live life with no regrets at all. Uh, first off, thank you for meeting with us, Father Thomas. Sure. Uh, I read a lot about you. Okay. It's almost like really it's called it. feet, BuzzFeed you. Unsolved. Let me dream, How many exorcisms okay? have you performed? Let me dream. Formal exorcisms, I've probably performed 50 to 75. In <laughs> oh no 50 to 75 really father thomas okay what is the difference between All a right. ghost and a demon 
All right. The ghost would refer to a disembodied human soul. Yeah, what's a up? A demon is a preternatural angelic creature. I only know what like half of those words mean. That rebelled against God. Uh -oh. It's not human. No, it's not. It's not Their human. life form is dying. They've been dying since the moment they rebelled. And so they are attracted to human beings for two reasons. One, because they are parasitic uh -huh. and they feed off our life form. But secondly, humans are just incredibly attractive. I mean, come on, come, come on, man, come on, man. Hey, fist bump, fist bump. This is this is really actually just just inappropriate, Pastor. Ah, okay, okay, whatever. Okay, what's what's actually the second reason? Their goal is to take as many of us to hell with them as possible because they already. <laughs> that is um. That is a little. That's a little different. That is a little different from what I thought. Um. That's, that's a little, that's a little bit, that's a, that's a little bit different. All right. How do you know they've lost? I'm not trying to evangelize oh, you. I, I, oh, no, I just no. got a shiver down no. my spine. <laughs> that's so, not good. Can a ghost and a demon both possess or maybe influence the living? Why would yes. you want to know that, Ryan? And Why would you want business. to know that, Ryan? Where are these homes you're going into? Where are One these of homes? them is nearby here, the uh -oh. Winchester Mystery House. <laughs> I, that is, this is the one, this is the one house that I have actually heard of before. I don't know what it is, but I have heard of it before. I don't know where, but I've heard of it before, and that terrifies me. Essentially, it's a haunted mansion. Okay. And the next one is a haunted doll island in Mexico City. The last place is perhaps the scariest. It's a house infested with a demon. All right. Do you have any advice for us going into some of these places where we may come into contact with not so nice spirits? Okay. Are we still on camera? Okay. What? If these places he, you're going... Why did he ask that? Why did he... One, I have two questions for this guy. One, why did he ask that? Two, why did he ask this question? Are we still on camera? When there was a camera right in front of him. This guy does not have good peripheral vision, I don't think. I, I don't think this guy has very good peripheral vision, if I'm entirely honest. <laughs> yes, are we still on camera? There is one right next to him. I don't trust this guy. Okay. If these places you're going uh -huh. claim to have spiritual attachments, I would do nothing to invite them into any kind of conversation. I Yo, tree demon! Wanna get Pizza Hut? Why do I- oh boy, I- as soon as I said that, I just felt dizzy for a second there. I'll take that as a no. I will- I will take that one. As a no, actually. I actually just got so dizzy. I would do nothing to invite them to somehow show themselves or talk uh -huh. them in any way. You don't want to create a tie with them. So treat it like a fine art museum. I would. Would it be possible yeah. for you to perhaps bless some water for something for me to carry? Yeah, to get some, some, get some of the water. water That's fine. I can bless it. You can bless it. In the it. name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy bless Spirit. Bless that Dasani. In your kindness, hear our prayers and pour down the blessing. Bless that Dasani. Amen. So that the health obtained by calling Amen. upon your holy name may be made secure Bless against that. all attack. Bless that Dasani, Christ. my man. Amen. Thank you. Thank you for Do it. sitting down with us and thank sure. you for yep. Do this it. This is fascinating. This yeah, was, was super helpful okay. and I feel a lot better about Good. Do it. what's about Good. to happen. Good. Like, I just feel so comforted right now. And where we're about to go, it's going to be ex the exact opposite. So, yeah. You're not worried about oh, that? Oh, boy. No. You're not worried about that? Okay, okay. Why are we doing this? I don't know if we got this on camera, but uh -huh. me, uh, do not be afraid. I, I mean, I will. Uh, I am very scared. But, okay. um, All right. Do not be afraid. If anything happens, just. <laughs> I mean, good advice, man. Good advice. It is. What time is it right now? 2 a.m. Do not be afraid. That's all you have to keep repeating. It is 2 a.m. right now. Bible. Jesus said chill. <laughs> Jesus said chill. <laughs> yeah, sure. All right, right now we're on our way to the Winchester. Jesus Just said chill. Pastor. That is terrifying. Holy water. Got our Wait, what? Where is now that? Now we're on our way to the Winchester. Just of course it's in San Jose. Of course it is. I don't know what that means, but like, of course it is. Spent with the pastor. Got our holy water. Got our tips, our demon tips. All right. 
Uh, this looks like Disneyland. I wouldn't be surprised <laughs> if they got cotton candy in there. Yuck it up, man. Yuck it up. You're really enjoying this, but when the lights go off, this may be a little different. Oh, this man. This is beautiful. Yeah, that does look like a Disneyland attraction. Oh, never mind. It looks like Satan just decided to sit right, right on that. Oh, no. You are full of shit if you do not feel strange right now. No, I don't. <laughs> Such a fucking shyster, dude. <laughs> uh -huh. My neck is standing over. This is crazy. Right now, we're sitting in the bedroom of a Sarah Winchester who built. Now, why would you want to do that? Why would you want to sit in the bedroom of someone, just of anyone? Why? <sighs> Warning for dolls and spiders. This episode. Okay, I will put. I'll put a nice little warning for spooky topics in my title. Thank you for letting me know. Warning for spook. Oh, I just completely misspelled warning. I spelled it like warbub. Warning for spooky, spooky subjects and, 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 and why can't I spell? And, 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 and there we go. Imagery. Okay, I get imagery right, but I can't. I, I spent like five times trying to spell and. <laughs> this mansion oh, no. has the result of a terrible tragedy. Sarah actually passed away in this very room in that bed right there. Of course she did. Why wouldn't she? Why? Gosh darn it. Hell of a bed. I, I assure you, in like half of the places you've been, people have died mm -hmm. there. People have probably died in the Chipotle we just ate at. Uh-oh. Let's just get into it. Okay. Sarah Pardee was born around 1840 to a very wealthy family. In 1862, in her early 20s, Sarah married William Winchester, whose father, Oliver Winchester, okay. founded the company that made the Winchester repeating All right. rifle, a rifle that will become the he made a weapon, weapon of, of death. In the he made a weapon of death. In 1866, That's always a good Sarah sign. That's awesome. First child. Shout out to that Annie guy. Pardee Winchester. No, no, no. But unfortunately, their daughter would no, die no, from no. a disease called Marasmus only a month and a half later. In uh -huh. 1880, William's father, Oliver Winchester, you. passed away. Thank you. Thank you. The ten tier ones. Thank you so much. I hope we're doing well. He was seven after. months as well. He tragically died in March 1881. Oh, of course he did. Of course he did. Why wouldn't he? Oh. <laughs> that was the most disingenuous. <laughs> that, 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 <laughs> that was real. Okay. Now that we've laid down the facts, let's get into the legend. William's death was almost unbearable for Sarah, who, according to uh -huh. legend, reached out to spiritualists <gasps> and mediums in Boston <laughs> to help her understand why would you do that? Why would you, why would you do, do that? Why would you do that? Why? Gosh darn it, dude. And the deaths of her daughter and husband. This Many sucks. believe that it was one fateful visit to a particular medium that would change her life. The uh -huh. medium told Sarah that her family was being haunted by the spirits of those killed by the Winchester rifle and that her family members deaths were retribution. The medium said Sarah's family was cursed and that the only way to yeah. lift the curse was to move west and build a house and never stop building. <laughs> okay. Well, thank you Jelly Dirt for the tenter once. Thank you. I think thank I know you. the end of this story. Uh-oh. The good spirits would guide her on what to okay. build. Okay. And if she continued building, she could live forever. What? But if she stopped, the evil spirits that were victims of the Winchester rifle <sighs> would haunt Sarah forever. If you can live no. forever. Great. But if you have to continue to build a house that entire time, unless you're having fun, which I don't think she well, was. Well, she wasn't like oh, putting on no. a hard hat and like physically making the house herself. She was delicate. <laughs> this well, is not that's good. Why she didn't live forever. Because she found a loophole. <laughs> I won't argue that your logic is flawed. I just hate it because it's <sighs> Thank you, Trickster, for the 10 tier ones as well. Thank you say, so much. Sarah followed the medium's advice. Oh, and moved no. West, where she built an eight room farmhouse in San Jose. Uh -huh. It is estimated that 500 to 600 rooms were built. Why? But due to her constant remodeling, only 161 rooms remain. One of which was newly discovered in October 2016. Uh -huh. I think the ghost just checked in every like three, <laughs> three to five years. Check like, your time we card. See if she's still building that. Otherwise, we gotta kill her. <laughs> However, what makes this mansion famous oh, no. isn't the size or amount of rooms. Okay, what makes it's it famous? The peculiar nature in which they were constructed. Of course. It was built this way in an effort to confuse the evil spirits that were haunting and following Sarah. The walkways right. are narrow and twist and turn around the mansion. Great. There are stairs that lead to the ceiling, 
and doors of that course there is walls. why would and why in not instance a door known as the door to nowhere that opens to a sheer drop on the outside of the house from the second floor. imagine you are like severely imagine you are like really really intoxicated right and you're just like all right that's my room you open up the door and you just walk just right out of that you just walk right out of that honestly there's a horror movie about this house you should check it out i would rather not actually i would rather have another another dream where i was stabbed <laughs> i actually probably will watch it to be honest i actually love horror so much chat it's it's really it's really great it is it is fantastic chat it is really really great all right floor i can't imagine a ghost would get foiled into falling into these bushes down here but the thought <laughs> is nice <laughs> all right now that we've established the legend let's okay. discuss some possible alternate theories as to why sarah what are the theories did. give it to me one theory that explains some give it to me aspects of the house is Ryan. Sarah's arthritis that affected her late in her life arthritis <laughs> why is that the evil that's not the evil is that the evil demon guys is arthritis a demon <laughs> Guys, is, is arthritis a demon? Is that... Uh-oh. One area called the Hall of Fires. Okay. All the way lined with fireplaces. Now, why would you want that? Why, why would you, why would you want that? Why, why on earth would you want that kind of thing? All right, let's just, let's just keep going, shall we, chat? It's purpose to perhaps aid Sarah's arthritis. This could provide... Oh, wait. Heat. Heat helps with arthritis. That makes sense, actually. You know what? Good the job, Sarah. For an unfinished staircase, okay. Possibly Thank you, Jelly no Dirt, for the 10 tier ones again. Thank you. I struggle to see how this explains a door to nowhere. No, that doesn't Nobody make any sense. Nobody is building a house like this because It's a trash they movie. Okay. I'm saying this is, that is not a, this is, this is is not a theory. A, I'm just stating the No theories. one says, oh, my knuckles feel a little funny. I'm going to build a house with 500 I, I, rooms. I hear you, man. I hear, I agree with you. I'm just saying that. <laughs> That's true. That's true. Yeah, no one, no one would do that. No one would do that, honestly. <laughs> My knuckles feel a little funny. I'm going to build a house with with 500 rooms. <laughs> oh, this man. is a theory that people believe, and I'm relaying the theory. That Those people are idiots. I mean, you know what the doctor says? <laughs> Nothing's better for arthritis than a two-story drop to the floor down below, right? <laughs> right, yeah. Another theory is that Sarah needed a change of scenery and continued to build to keep her mind occupied and off her grief. That makes sense. Well, that, yeah. <laughs> so maybe she just wasn't very good at planning and she did that for her entire life yeah, for her entire life. <laughs> okay that's why i'm saying hey, we all need hobbies another theory comes from historian mary jo ignafo who investigated sarah winchester ignafo believes sarah was devoted uh, to building because she was interested in architecture that's another good one ignafo reports that sarah's own letters reveal that construction stopped at months at a time despite oh. what legend would suggest okay ignafo also explains the unfinished state of rooms as the result of an earthquake in 1906 that caused damage to the house uh -oh, theorizing that's not good. that sarah simply shut down that area of the house rather than attempting yeah. repairs and finally she also could not find evidence that sarah communicated with spirits Although, okay i will say i can't imagine communicating with spirits produces any kind of receipt no nobody has evidence of that. okay i'm just so, saying i yeah. call bullshit yeah, yeah. I, I agree <laughs> with your calling of bullshit good i am Amen. glad we agree on something yeah. for once yeah. we've done it okay <laughs> we've done it we've done it let's go home now but enough conjecture Let's look at some of the spiritually active areas of this very unsettling okay. house. Okay. Oh, this room looks like a nightmare. Spiritually That's active There's areas. There's a few rooms in All this right. house that strike me as, okay, this is ghost town. This could be it. Uh, I don't like this. Oops. What? The way the shadows play with your... Huh? Well, I, I didn't see something. I heard what was that? Something. Thank you for the four months. Right YAZ, thank you. And thank you, there. Star, as well. And thank you, a bunch of underscores and letters for that's the tier one. That's also a concern, I mean, but... Ah, oh, bats are no. Oh, no. Oh, no. One room no. that's particularly important is a room uh -huh. called the Blue Or as some know it, the Seance Room. The Seance Room, room why not? Go right ahead. ...with the good spirits on a nightly basis for building guidance. The room has three entrances and one door that is like a trap door dropping into the kitchen down below Dro and not dropping into the kitchen excuse me a child's just playing <laughs> just, just falls into the kitchen why would you 
Right. Surprisingly, this is one of the most active rooms in the house. What? With reports of organ music being heard. Cold now, what exactly is organ music? Which organ do you mean? Because we are talking about ghosts here. Thank you, Bellin, for the five tier ones. Thank you. Uh, do you believe in ghosts? Yes, I do. Old spots and people experiencing dizziness. What is this thing doing? It's making noises. What is? Uh oh. I just took out a brand new battery. I just took huh? plastic from it and put it in. And it drained it all the way to zero. Child becomes dinner, someone says. Good highly job. Unusual. This I've is highly unusual. This before. <laughs> I'm just gonna ignore you and fix the issue. <laughs> I'm gonna lock myself in here with a ghost. Okay, good job, Shane. I turned my flashlight off. Oh, this is horrifying. I bet Ryan wouldn't do this. It is true. Oh, he's there. Oh, fucking come on, man. Ha ha ha. I knew he was going to do that. It's so scared me. Fuck <laughs> you. The house as a whole has reports of hearing people breathing, footsteps, That's hearing not screws good. being unscrewed and dropped to the floor. Why? Full body apparitions well, if you hear that, I guess you could say you're screwed. The most famous spirit being Sarah Thank you. herself, Thank you, chat. often seen in her bedroom. Thank you, Naturally, chat. one of the creepiest and most active places in the what entire is house is the basement. Of course it's the basement. Of course it's the basement. I'm going to... Uh... <sighs> Oh, there go my headphones right off of my head. That's not good. It's not good. Guests and workers often claim to uh -oh. see the ghost of a caretaker named Clyde pushing yeah. a wheelbarrow. Why I'm walking here by my fucking self is beyond me. <sighs> Fuck, I'm so scared. Okay. Uh, man. All right, apparently this is where a recurring ghost is seen. Thank you, Jolly Dirt, for the 10 tier ones. Thank you. Oh, uh, what, what are you? Oh, okay. Thank you for that. Thank you for that one. Oh, yeah. By the way, chat, this is a recorded episode. You are you are safe and everything. I know that I might have, like, caused some stuff with that little ghost bit, but I, I mean, I, I did see it. But, like, um, you're, you're safe. Do not worry. All right? Know that. All right. Let's, let's continue. Hey, hey man. Calm oh, down. God. He's there. Piece of shit, Shane. My mic went out. And then I was looking for you. He's crouching <laughs> in here like some kind of cave creature. And then I, all I did was I went. Uh, I was just oh yeah! Coming so to you say hello to you. You're looking for me, not grunting like a zombie. Uh, you almost scared me to death. I'm never gonna forgive you for that. <laughs> Hope you're fucking proud of yourself. What was that? You saw me. What was that? Inhale. Oh shit! Jesus Christ! I, I saw you. I really didn't think it was gonna work. Just inhale, Sarah but it made that noise. Life of solitude. She reportedly uh -oh. wore dark veil at almost all times to mask her appearance. And in 1922, Sarah died at the age of 83. That's not good. In the well, end, actually, the 83, that's remained. not bad for the 20s. Was this just the result of a woman filled with grief? That's really not or bad for the 20s. Or were the evil spirits that haunted Sarah Winchester so horrifying that they drove her and perhaps possessed her to build until her death? She probably believed that spirits did say this. Okay. Whether or not that's a thing that actually happened, I, you know. So you're saying it's more along the lines of grief. Okay. Is, perhaps. I mean, she went through some. Oh some man. Stuff. Let me just ask you straight out: Do you believe ghosts are real right now? Uh oh. <laughs> uh, no. What? Why do you not believe ghosts? Shane. Shane. Man. Uh, I've never seen one. Okay. I mean, there's a lot of things that you can't see that you are real. I feel. Like. Why can't see I some moldy see baby dolls? You were the first real. person to yeah, say I that. Can drop an apple. <laughs> Guess you'll just you'll just never believe me until Look, something happens. Hey, this whole entire trip, I'm I'm ready. Hey, that's ghosts, good. Don't t tussle my hair. I would do nothing to invite them to somehow show themselves. <laughs> uh, they did. They did a cut back. That's. Mean, I'll, I'm gonna start. Pa I'm gonna stop pausing. Gonna push, I'm sorry. <laughs> Let's have some fun. Here I am. Regardless, the real reason behind the creation of the Winchester Mystery House will remain unsolved. I'm so Aww. proud of her for doing this, by the way. I'm always disappointed it's when it's really called Unsolved, but it's called it's BuzzFeed Unsolved. No, I've genuinely, like, this is... Where is BuzzFeed Solved? I want to see them see a ghost. I want to see them... I want to see them see a ghost. That's what I want to... That's what I want to do. I am so incredibly out of it. I have... I, I feel so just... I think... I don't know... I don't know if it's... I think... I think it's something that I ate. Um, but I feel absolutely terrible right now. And this is just not, not helping. Like, 
it, it just started to get like a lot worse all of a sudden. Like I feel, oh, that's so weird. Okay. Neat. If I have to spend one more moment Let's sitting continue. in this chair, looking at that silly face, <laughs> I think I may murder you myself. Oh no. <laughs> all right. We're getting out of here. Why'd you murder Shane? Fun. Yeah, let's leave this house. Checking out uh, San Jose. Checking out San Jose. Onward. Onward Thank to, you may bear uh, for the Mexico. five good ones. Thank yeah, why you. Not? Ooh, some nice upbeat music. That's nice. Bow, 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 bow. So we're in Mexico, so that's pretty cool. Uh, we don't have to go to our next horrible place until tomorrow, so bow, 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 I think bow, we're going to enjoy the city a little bit tonight. What a jam. <gasps> Street meat. Let's go. Chat, don't worry. I'm taking care of myself. Do not worry. I don't need a lot of... I do not need a lot of, of, of people in my, in, my, in my computer screen to tell me my basic human functions. I am glad that you guys care, but I am okay. Do not worry. Now, Paul, get the street meat, everyone. Paul, get the street meat. All right, all right, all right. I don't know if this is a sign, but I'm in the bathroom at this bar, and this mirror literally has blood dripping from it. But I'm going to go order another beer, so we're good. Salud! Salud! Oh. We're getting a drink in Mexico, and we ran into the Grimm from Harry Potter. Okay. <laughs> this is crazy. Yo, Puppy. Hi, Puppy. Goodbye, Puppy. Puppy Mexico is gone. Such a nice city. Yeah, it is. Shame we're on our way to a nightmare. You're on your way to a nightmare. Uh oh I'm on my way to a nice <laughs> retreat. Okay. We'll see. <laughs> Oh man. Right now why are, is it why is it playing like papers <laughs> please music? To the dock. We, we were just sort of brown. I guess that's how you use the trickers. Brown. <laughs> brown. Hey, get on, get on, get on. Okay. Oh fuck. Okay. Hey, what's up? That okay. Almost, uh, two bike trolley collision right there. So uh I'm actually not quite sure where we are right now. No, it's fine. Just... I just gotta say, I love that I love that like that meat that's on the um that's on like the spinny tube. Um, I, 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 that is, it is fantastic. It is so good. It is, it is very incredibly good. I just, I just got to say that. I don't know what it's called, but it is good. It is the, it is the, it's the meat that they showed earlier. The meat that was, um, that was on the spinny, spinny metal thing. That was awesome. I want to have, I want to have that now, but everything's closed. Just go with the flow, right? That's what people used to say on their way to their death. Uh-oh. So we survived our little trolley over here. We're joined by Pepe from Busby, Mexico. Hey! Right now we're on the outskirts of Mexico City. We got another guy! Soji Milko, heading to our next location, the terrifying Island of the Dolls. Ooh? This is a mistake. Oh yeah, there's also a thunderstorm about thunderstorm. So Thank fine. you, Squidby, for the yeah. center ones. Thank you so fine. much. Look at the kids fine. <laughs> and hey, like the kid's weenie. fine. Good you job, kid. Did that kid just litter? <laughs> and now I feel like a big weenie. Are... Oh my god. This can't be a good sign. Barbie Look at that. Weenie. He put it. No. He put it in the ocean. No. You jelly dirt for the ten turtles. You put it in the oat. That's gonna. That's not also not an ocean. <laughs> I'm so stupid. <laughs> oh man. It's been said that people don't like these canals due to Canal. the bad energy. Those who navigate the canals claim the dolls lure them to the island. One trahanera. The dolls do what now? Excuse, excuse me. The dolls. Do what? Also, nice follower count. Let's go. Aww. Ruined it. Our operator claims that he was even possessed for multiple days when approaching the island. This is the beginning of a horror movie right now. <laughs> That's never a good sign when you're going ghost hunting. I just gotta say that. We're here, and it's raining. That's not good. Lovely. Yep. Shall we? Yep. Shall go. do it. Go, go ahead, go Shane and Ryan. You are both equally it's an awesome. Cloud in the sky. But one of you is slightly better. Which it's one? Very... I'm not saying. 
A very atmospheric thunder. Hell no. Hell no. No. No, no, no. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, this seems all horrible and awful in general. And this is so... Wow. <laughs> that speech I don't like that. This. Oh, there's spiders everywhere, so that's nice. I uh, See, I'm more concerned about the spiders than the ghosts. Is that right? Yeah. This island is not as pleasant at night. So Pepe, you're telling me okay. you don't come here every weekend? Yeah, where is Pepe? No, I, this is not one of my favorite places. <laughs> <laughs> in the 1950s he in Mexico, like it. Don Julian Santana Barrera okay. was persecuted for being overzealous in his religious beliefs. After that, okay. for reasons unclear, Julian abandoned his wife and child and moved to the island we're at tonight in the Xochimilco canals in the outskirts of Mexico City. Okay. The island we're sitting on is a chinampa, a okay. man-made floating garden engineered, engineered by, by the Aztecs Ooh, centuries okay. ago. Dope. I'm sure they'd be thrilled with uh, what it's become. <laughs> you think this is what they had in mind? <laughs> he wants yeah, for the five-tier ones. Thank you. Oh, monkey. Oh, okay. Monkey? No, I thought I, I thought I got bitten the ass cheeks by a spider. Oh, There's what a now? lot of spiders here. Oh, they're huge. Julian lived on this island in isolation, and the story goes that he discovered the body of a young girl off the shore of the island. Julian was reportedly overcome with grief due to the fact that he could he not did. save this little girl. Legend has it that shortly oh, after her no. body emerged, a doll appeared where her body was. Of course it did! I don't even know how deep this water is. Like if someone were to drown in this, I feel like <sighs> it looks like it's shallow, but I guess it's deceiving. Wow, this <sighs> place is creepy. Really? Yeah. Thank you for letting me know. Oh, look, a teddy bear. <laughs> hey, nice, a teddy bear. Oh, oh, oh I would. Oh, oh, never mind a spider. Julian thought the doll probably belonged to the girl and he hung it up on a tree on the island. Okay. His reasons for doing this vary depending on who is telling the story. Okay. Some believe he did this to honor the little girl's spirit. Oh, okay. Others believe he did this to appease the spirit and uh -oh. protect himself and the island. Oh, that's Another not good. Another variation is that Julian hung the doll to protect the girl's Why? spirit from demons in the afterlife. Oh, okay. Whatever the reason is, the girl's existence yeah. has never been officially confirmed. No, of course okay. not. Wait, the dead girl wasn't The dead girl was not confirmed. Well, what happened huh? to her body? What? I don't know. This is a long time ago. What did he do with it? I don't know. We're in the canals of Mexico. This is like, I don't know how things work. Is that how things I mean, work? It was the 1950s. Probably spiders hate her. Yeah. <laughs> uh, However, Julian didn't stop at one doll. Instead, he began to amass perhaps the creepiest collection in the history of oh, collections. Oh, of course it did. Perhaps he felt the more dolls he hung up, the more protected he would be from the spirit. Of course, get along man. Well with old Sarah Winchester. One could say that. He has Yay. a lifelong like, mission to appease the ghosts. I think it's more a protection thing. He just okay. doesn't want right. to die. He is oh, wearing a man. vest. <laughs> he would hunt for the lost dolls from the canal. Why would you do that? Island, stringing them up in whatever dilapidated condition he found them. And I don't as like this, this island grew, so did the island's reputation. I don't like this. Drawing new visitors that would trade dolls for produce from the island. I don't like this. I'm going to be honest. I don't like this. Consequently creating an extraordinarily bizarre barter system. He probably fucks the dolls. Bunch of, just a bunch of dolls. Oh, I thought you would have, a, like, some respect for this place, but... <laughs> nope. Went in straight with the he fucks the dolls. Yeah, I'm, I'm with Pepe on this. This yeah. is getting way off track. Sorry, okay. This, the compulsion oh, to collect man. and hang these dolls was so extreme that those close to him believed he was driven by an unseen force that changed okay. him forever. A force that many believe was the spirit of the young girl, haunting right. or perhaps possessing him to hang the dolls for 50 <laughs> straight years in isolation. 50 from years! Though he initially seemed to hang the dolls out of respect and nope. a desire for protection. I put my head Those down. Those friends claim that Julian eventually began to believe the dolls were possessed. Anytime I get even remotely spooked, I just look to the monkey with the sunglasses. <laughs> Let's get a great shot hey! of that thing. Those 50 years bring us to 2000. That guy's made me, that made me happy. The dolls came to an abrupt end. Julian's nephew, Anastasio, came to the uh -huh. island to help Julian plant pumpkins. According oh. to Anastasio, he left to work on the garden. Uh -huh. And when he returned, he discovered the body of his uncle floating in the canal. No! What's notably chilling <laughs> is the fact that Julian's body was found drowned in the oh, same no. spot. Oh, no. Thank you, Ali, for the $100 Thank you so this much. That's where it went down. I hope you're doing well. I hope you have an amazing right night here. as well. Thank you. Cool, 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 cool. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah, cool, cool, cool. Anastasio, who moved to the island after Julian's death, yeah. claims the dolls, quote, 
move their heads and whisper to each other. Oh. So they've got dolls that piss themselves. <laughs> I mean, do you no! think these dolls look like they have remotely any kind of technological capability? There, there was a Mickey Mouse over there with a little pull string. Did it a work? What? I don't know. I didn't touch it. I feel like you touched it. Pian, pian dolls? I did touch it. Oh, God. <laughs> Who do you think? Pian dolls. Oh, no. Pues la muchacha que se ahoga en 1950 porque en las noches se escuchan voces de mujer. Y mi okay. tío cuando estaba en vida caminaba con Just su tenis y su bastoncito. Of course you can hear it at night. Of course you can hear it at night. Of, oh, Is that no. a bed? Is that a guy? Oh no. Wait, what? Should we poke it with a stick? How about you, Shane? You poke it with a stick. Poke it. Poke it with a stick. Poke it with a stick! Well, there's no one there. Aww. Is a dream come true for you, right? I wanted to poke it with a stick! Uh, I can't say that. Don Julian Santana I Barretta do. was 80 at the time of his death. Some people think poke that the dolls or the spirits that inhabit them poke might have killed Poke it with a stick. Only. Again, uh, poke sure. it with a stick. <laughs> if that's what it's going to take poke to get us out of stick. here. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> I believe in all of this. Put it on Wikipedia and let's leave. But to finish this off, let's visit the area that has the most heightened activity on the island. Let's not. Let's go to a different place like McDonald's. I want to go to McDonald's. It's a shrine that Julian built inside a shed for his favorite dolls, including the original doll that Julian found all uh -huh. those years ago. Oh, okay. This is the shed where he kept his shrine, and there's candles inside, great. Of course there is! I did bring a little doll of my own. I hate this. I'm gonna be real. Do not, do not like this. This seems like a good spot to leave it, right? Or should I put it in the lap of the original? This is a fucking nightmare. Oh, man. Oh man. There's this is the terrifying right chat. What? Where? What? The one that looks. Oh! oh Jesus oh, Christ. Christ. Holy shit. Balls. Oh. <laughs> I was just about to put the offering on the original doll and then. Oh, that scared shit. me. There's a spider coming out of it. Oh my god. Uh, oh, nope. Fuck. Nope. Yeah, Not dealing with deep. that. Let's go. This is also his favorite doll right here. Nope. Okay, I don't care what his nope. favorite doll <laughs> Fuck that. Let's nope. go. <laughs> There's cats right there. No. Oh, fuck me. Oh. There are spiders oh. everywhere. Look at the size of that thing. <laughs> I'm gonna go under. <laughs> okay. Okay. Oh, there's we a lot of spiders. Fun. I don't like that. You're leaving this island. Yeah, leave, 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 in the yep, end, leave. Julian yep, leave. was remembered as a nice and welcoming man, but the mystery of his eventual death remains. Was it the result of his own compulsive uh -huh. behavior? Was it? Or was it the result of the spirit that he claimed haunted him for uh -huh. the last 50 plus years Is of it going to be solved? For now, and perhaps forever, the case remains unsolved. Aww. I like spiders. I think spiders are good. I think they're a great little insect or arachnid. Uh, but fuck everything about that place amen <laughs> i would love to bring father thomas to this island yeah bring father like father bring thomas father thomas <laughs> i don't think he bring would. bring what father thomas we well, love father thomas could, uh, exercise spiders bring, bring father father thomas oh there they go goodbye i don't know where that is all right on the way to oh, Manhattan. Kansas. i'm an idiot our showdown with the demon to end the trip <laughs> We've defeated the spiders. Killed all the we spiders. We set that whole island on fire. We survived the spirits of Winchester. Okay. I got my holy water ready. I'm ready for this show, Dad. I don't think you're right. wrong, frankly. Someone in chat just said best one, and I am now scared. Right now, we're on our way to a house widely considered to be infested with a demon that tortured really? a young family. I thought it was just going to be a nice finale. little picnic. We're going to the Selly House. Selly House? Oh, no. Everyone thinks feeling uh -huh. energy is bullshit, but okay. You don't feel strange at all. I do. A little bit. I no, feel strange. Really. Oh shit! What up? I'm taking a selfie with some demons, yo. Yeah. Hell yeah! Whoa. Yeah, my man. Great. That'll be good. I'm gonna snap that. Snap that.
Amen. Oh, Ryan! Listen, you're insufferable. <laughs> I'm just working myself up to you, you know. Ryan, oh God. Are you all right, man? <laughs> get in there. Yeah, I know. I'm just gonna get fucking holy water. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, Joke boy. on who you want. And don't ask me for some later. I uh -huh. won't. Uh huh. All they need is some WD-40. That will. I really don't like this chat. I'm gonna be real. Sure. I'm really selling it, huh? Baby doll. Baby doll. On the baby doll. Baby doll at the bottom of the stairs. Why is there a baby doll at the bottom of the stairs? Uh, I do not. I do not like that. I do not appreciate that. Why is there a baby doll at the bottom of the stairs? <laughs> Oh, oh no. Uh, uh, <laughs> uh one second. Let me do my let me do my demon cry real fast. Uh, okay, let's do this thing. They can't Baby. stop me anymore. Oh, this is nice. You know what the place I'm gonna haunt. would cost in Los Angeles? There's an arm and a leg. Let's just tell the story of this house. How about that? Ryan, don't look over here. There's a little stuffed animal. No, the stuffed animal. Don't wanna. Right now, we're sitting in the living mm -hmm. room of the Sally house. Our sleeping bags are right there. Okay. We foolishly plan on sleeping here for some stupid reason. I've lived my life by one adage, and that's oh, don't what fuck is with it? demons. It's an adventure. I just love seeing you squirm. Let's just get into uh -oh, why this house uh -oh, is. Uh -oh, tell uh -oh, your spooky uh -oh, story. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Located at 508 North 2nd Street in Atchison, Kansas, the Sally House is the ultimate haunted house and widely <sighs> considered to be one of the most haunted places in America. Built between 1867 and 1871, no! this house has had three deaths inside its walls. No! Michael Finney in 1872, no! Ryan True in 1918, no! and Agnes True in 1939. No! But while the deaths have perhaps added to the house's ah! ghostly inhabitants, Gosh, darn the real it. evil comes from something much different. All right, I think he's here. What? Who's here? So we called a paranormal investigator over. Sure. They got one of those guys? How's it going, man? Ryan. Eric Insbrenner. Shane. Eric, nice what's up, you. man? I think this is all bullshit. It, <laughs> half of it is. <laughs> Raw a little bit. I'm not going to communicate with shit. I would do nothing to invite them into any kind of conversation. Oh, why do they keep on cutting back to him? You're oh, no. I'll be, I'll be standing in the background. Uh-huh. Multiple residents of the Sally House have experienced paranormal activity. It wasn't until the 1990s when Deborah and Tony Pittman moved in that the activity was yeah. fully realized. Okay. What follows is based on their first-hand account of what started as a small haunting and later developed into a living nightmare. Oh no. Oh, I didn't Deborah like that. Deborah and Tony Pickman moved in on December 31st, 1992. Okay. The haunting started small. Lights in their house would dim. Their dog would bark incessantly at the entrance to the nursery, and their newborn baby would wake up every hour, quote, as if someone was playing with him. End quote. I don't the like Pittman's this. neighbor could see the nursery window for the prime. from her Thank house you. and eventually asked Deborah why she kept the light on in the you nursery all night well long the prime. with Thank the baby you. sleeping in there. This question came as an icy shock to Deborah. Yeah. Who always turned the light off. Turn the light off. Everybody wants <laughs> him. <laughs> Sorry. All right. Sorry. <laughs> Anyways. Things got especially weird on July 14th, 1993, mm -hmm. when Deborah, Tony, and her sister Karen discovered all the stuffed animals in the nursery organized. Burn that place to the ground. Burn it to the ground. I'm. How do you see that? And your first thing is not, you know what? Lighter. Lighter. Burn that house to the ground. I don't want to see it around here anymore. I don't, I don't want to feel it. I don't want to smell it. Burn that house to the ground or else I'm going to start. I'm going to burn it myself. I'm not going to do that. Um, don't do crimes chat. Twitch TOS is important. And also a life of crime is not a life that you want to live. All right. Nice into a neat circle back to back in the middle of the room. On the floor. Burn the house the three of them down. It was one of them playing a practical joke. So they put the animals back. Uh -huh. Turned off the light and went downstairs. Yeah. To their horror, when they returned, not they only were was back. the light they were on, back, huh? but a bear was knocked off its chair and yeah. lay on its back on the ground. Of course. <laughs> we better get out of this house. Somebody knocked our little bear out of his little wicker you're chair. Telling, you're telling me you wouldn't be uh, unnerved by going upstairs and seeing a bunch of stuffed animals organized into a little cult circle when no one did it? So who did, um, I don't know. After that, like anybody would, they packed up some stuff took their baby and left the house to stay with Tony's parents. Uh -huh. Did they bring the bear? I don't believe they brought the bear. Oh no. I mean, there's, I can't imagine they would bring the bear. 
While Why would they not bring the, the bears? Tony felt a sharp sting in his back. When they lifted up his shirt, they discovered three long scratches. Tony would continue to get viciously scratched as time went on. No, and in not one instance, Tony. A scratch manifested while on video. No, not Tony. The Pickmans eventually returned to a psychic who picked not, up on not a presence. Not my man Tony with Sally. the three scratches. Sally, if you're here, or any spirit that's here, uh -huh. please communicate. Okay. Here's a flashlight. If you can turn the flashlight on, let us know you're here. That'd be great. Don't do it, 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 Oh no. Demon? Uh huh. Stop call you that. Demon. Stop it. Stop talking to it. No, I just want to talk to the demons. We no. met a pal named Father Thomas. Yeah. Uh, he told us not to talk to you, but I think you oh. guys are swell. I would do nothing to invite them to somehow show themselves or taunt them. Why do they keep on playing that one if you clip? Like the guy staying here, turn the light on. Okay. You're fucking crazy, Shane. If you don't like us, turn it on. Please don't turn it on. Please don't. Oh! No! Oh! Oh! What the fuck? Oh shit! Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Where's my holy water? Where's my holy no, water? No, 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 Please, just turn it on. I don't think I don't think they have the power to turn it back on again. Frankly, I really think they don't. Ryan. <gasps> <gasps> oh no! You've got to be mind, kidding me. Night here. <laughs> Please turn the light off for spirits. Don't you fucking do it. Turn it all the way off. No, no, no. Thank you. Oh. oh what? Oh my god. What Please try. This? Oh my god. You should have never talked to it, dude. Oh no. That's a car. Oh no. Oh okay. no. No, that's the fucking flashlight rolling in the background. Look, it's coming oh, back. Oh yeah, it is. Oh no. It's a flashlight, it rolls, it's cylindrical. Oh, it shouldn't no. roll back and forth like what? that. What? You should have never talked to it, dude. What is wrong with you? And what may be a curious coincidence, a former resident who lived in the You've house be before the me. said, quote, What did he say? My daughter was five at the time. Uh -huh. She had an imaginary friend, Sally. Ah! I would scold her for something, no. and she would come back and tell me, I didn't do that, Sally did it. No! Or Sally told me to do it. When shown Tony Pickman's drawing 11 years after they moved out of the house, no. the daughter identified it as her imaginary friend from her childhood. No! Do not be afraid, do not be afraid, do not be afraid, do not be afraid, do not be afraid. What the? Do not be afraid. What the? No! Hey, just take a, take, sit down, it's fine. Okay, well, don't hurt your... I'm gonna... Oh, okay, it's okay. I mean, oh my sure, god. We don't know how to explain that. Maybe it's just, you know, flashlights are funny like that. The Pikmins also reported fires that would start on their own. In fact, two former residents before the Pikmins uh, reported fires starting inexplicably in the room that would eventually become the Pikmins nursery. Of course the it's the nursery. The activity continued to escalate Children, beyond fires. The number one cause of ghosts. Kick mother. your local Tony child in the gut today. In his bed. Quote, almost like you had an animal digging to get oh out of the Oh my god. Room. End quote. And in one instance, Sally appeared in the room and grabbed Tony's wrist, burning dark red finger marks into yeah, his arm. Yeah, go kick that At kid. At this point, Tony believed, kick that quote, kid. we're dealing with something way beyond a little girl, end quote. Kick it. And begged to leave kick the it. house. Yet Deborah, kick it. who at this point never kick witnessed it. anything alarming, didn't kick share the same desire. The this girl. The These people had, like, video recorders. Kick you know, the demon girl. I mean, girl. the scratches all happen on camera, but yeah. here's the thing. This is what I fucking love about, like, paranormal evidence. People are always clamoring for it, right? Like, where's the evidence? And then when the evidence finally is there, it's like, fake. Things eventually went beyond physical terror, however. Here's another quote from Tony. Quote, what? it got to the point where I, when I was in the house, I could not think Shut any up, happy Tony! Thought. It was just strictly I wanted to hurt her. Shut I, up! I was a whole different person. That something could come inside me and make me Move out, of Tony, doing you that, idiot! Just, it tears me up. As much as I hate to say it, I'd planned on slitting her throat. Tony! Jesus Christ! If you slit my throat tonight, I'm gonna have a hard time forgiving you for that. Will you haunt me for the rest of my life? No, because I'll be dead. Well, Ghosts then... aren't real. Oh, okay. Oh. Fair enough. In 1994, the Pikmins finally moved out of the house. 
But at this point, you're probably wondering who is Sally. That's so odd. What I could find. Oh, Records God. show that Sally Isabel Hall did indeed Jesus live in the house in 1905. But she was actually a 34 year old black. I don't woman. like looking at that. Wait, wait. I'm gonna be real. <laughs> what? Hear me out. Hear me out here. Okay. That's okay. not for While content. This may seem I'm at first, I... The implications of that this genuinely made me unsettled. Oh, stop it. Fact, stop showing never it. Never a girl named Sally who lived here. Then who or what <sighs> was this alleged spirit presenting itself as a little girl named Sally? That question led me to this piece of research. Sometimes, Inhuman presences or demons will allegedly present themselves as humans that are physically flawed. Or in some oh, cases, perhaps shoot. like this one, they may appear as children. Stop show, oh, Jesus Christ! That demon's racist. He was like, oh, there was a, a oh black my lady God. who lived here? Wait a minute. No, oh, I can't haunt with that. Thank you, Jelly, for well, the 10 tier ones. Little, Thank you. Little white girl. A little blonde one. I'll give her. You've got to be kidding me. Don't fuck that demon. He's whitewashing. You've got to be kidding house. me. This is exactly what's wrong with Hollywood. Oh, don't unofficial, dream raid. Don't unofficial dream raid. Welcome, unofficial dream raiders. No, the an sum. entity like an entity that's not human. It needs energy. It needs. Welcome, unofficial dream raider, so raiders. That, Follow if you have not already. We're reacting to scary stuff. I think I'm going to do one more episode after this. Demons race. So welcome, dream raiders. But what really suggests the presence of a demon is something that occurred in the basement well after the Pikmins left the house. Uh huh. Tenant, her husband, and their children moved into the house. one more after this, so welcome, no unofficial dream raiders. Make sure but you follow if you're not visit already. From landlord Les Smith, welcome, welcome. He allegedly discovered something terrifying in the basement. A large pentagram on the floor. Oh, an altar, a I don't like this. I don't like this. Rope. I don't like this chat. Hat, I'm gonna be real. Hey man, don't like this. Dudes. This is, this is terrifying. <laughs> Eyeballs. That's I'm so scared. Many believed that this female tenant was a Satan worshiper, performing sacrificial rituals. To this day, Satan there's a worshiper. black mark on the floor where the alleged oh, rituals took no. place. You've Consequently, be kidding many me. believe the demon lives in this basement. Welcome on official Dream Raiders. Hope it was a good stream. Wall, it, which I don't know if it was an official or unofficial Thomas one, but in case demons. it's an official one, I was reading uh, about congrats Dream on 25 mil. That's awesome. A demon will just take that's a, that's a quarter so of a hundred million, which is absolutely nuts. Good job, Dream. I, other kinds good of job there. Thank you, Ash, for the tenter ones. The cult. It would not I don't know. I don't know if he's here, but if he is, then good job, Dream. Attached because that's awesome. That cult basically had a home. And it opened oh, a of course Absolutely. it opened up a portal here. Of course it did. Of course it did. No. If you're there in the hole, oh, no. you must speak to us or communicate with us. Turn that flashlight on. Yeah. Don't turn the flashlight Please on. Don't, Please don't, don't. do Please it. Don't. Don't Let's do see. it. Right. Oh, thank God. Okay, thank you. So God. we're giving off high MF here because Sub goal. Oh, thank okay. you guys. I so will change it once. Read. But since this episode is done. Coming through the hair, thank you, Gray, for the five tier ones. Thank you. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's shoot. Why not, right? He's hungry. Yeah, congrats to Dream again. Very cool. Turn that light on. I think this demon's a wimp. He's lost his mind. You want to lay on the pentagram? Woo, this here sucks. You're out of your mind. Rock and roll, buckaroo. If you want to eat my heart, just turn that light on. If you want to eat don't, Brian's heart, don't, don't stop light putting no, me in your don't, No pal, eating hearts. Stop. We're a package deal. <gasps> ah! The lights on. No, oh, the, the lights, lights turned on. Are you kidding me? Jesus Christ. Turn off for us, please. Are Brian you kidding face. me? Ah! What the no! heck? No. No, oh, what the heck? Fuck, this house so hard. Well, now we get to spend the night here. No. Here's a fun fact about no. something here. One past no, resident that's just not right. To a, quote, grotesque and gaunt deadly <gasps> Oh, Jesus Christ. Not only that's... laying next to her, but staring at her. Oh, I don't like this. I Here's cover the thing. My I eyes. discount almost 100% of... Jesus I saw Christ. it in the middle of the night things because sleep paralysis. Oh, I don't like this. Most people wake this up is not good, shit. chat. If I wake up tonight and there is... <laughs> This grotesque looking things laying next to me and just staring at me with its uh -huh. fucking stupid beady eyes open. I I'm gonna shit myself. I feel you. I feel you. Jesus Christ. Pulling, Christ. And I'm just gonna carry out oh, the fleet. I'm gonna roll it up. Put put it roll it up. Garbage can. Put it in the garbage can. My big fucking poo burrito. And that's. that's... <laughs> I'm never coming back. I'll leave all the shit. I'm fucking never coming this back. This is dumb. The fact oh, that we're my sleeping goodness. in this house after what we saw is astounding. I'm proud yeah. of mine. Time yeah. to sleep. Lights out, I guess. Yeah. Fuck. So we're gonna sleep here all night. 
Uh, it's gonna be dreadful. Oh man. I mean, it's weird thinking what's directly below us is that What's, basement. Oh, that basement. Why would you say that? I'm Why would you say that? Get closer to you. I don't care. <laughs> okay. Yo, look at the homies. Every little pin drop that you hear, every little oh, creak, God. it's gonna make your butthole tighten. Don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. <clears throat> what? I thought I saw something move out of the corner of my eye. I will stay in this house till 5 a.m. If I sleep, you've I sleep. You've got to be kidding me. I think it would be a sleep full night for me if it weren't for you. <laughs> oh, the light went out outside. Did you turn Does, that out? No. Yeah, you did. I didn't, no. Oh, what? Weird. They didn't? Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm not enough to admit this is not, this is not happening. Oh, no. I, I can't. It's not happening. It's not this happening. This sucks. Ever. Okay, man. Look, this yeah, sucks. Okay. I think I just blacked out. <laughs> You've given up? This Don't sucks. Like Thank you, Jelly oh, I mean, Dirt, for the 25 tier ones. Here's what, here's what I'm, I'm not doing. having a good time. Is at three, right? Why is it three? That's the mock <gasps> What was that? Three. What was that? Jesus Christ, what was that? Why is it three? That's to mock the Holy Trinity. Sometimes Oh that that's just the guy. That's just Oh, that's just the guy. Oh, thank you, Jolly Shore, for the that's just the guy. I got so scared of that. Oh my so god. Three knocks. That's a demon. When it hits three o'clock. I got so scared for a for second minutes. there. No, you won't. I will. Can you give me time updates? Like one minute, two minutes? Yeah. Yeah. Three. Two, one. 3 a.m. Gosh darn it. Gosh darn it. Gosh darn it. Oh, this sucks, dude. This That's sucks. Oh, oh. Oh. It's another minute. If we do a legitimate ghost hunting thing, I'm gonna be terrified. Three, two, Woo! Done. Oh, thank you, Jesus Christ. Oh, we're He's good. Okay, yeah. we're done. The we're, done. we're done. We're done. Oh, we're done. Just we're done. We're good. Body right now. Good job. Uh, good job, Shane Ryan. Right now, great job, guys. But great, great job, guys. Are you trying to convince me to stay in here? Nope. Well, no. I just think it's silly to just give no. up the last minute. But whatever. You know. <laughs> no. Look, you've made up your mind. You're done. You don't have yep. it in you. Oh. <laughs> Stop saying that. You're making me want to say it. You don't have oh it in you. no. <laughs> Why is it so dramatic? Do not be afraid. Shut up. I don't like you. You're right. I don't have it in me. Yeah, let's go. Hey, <laughs> amen. Let's go. <laughs> let's go. Right. Let's leave. Fuck let's you. leave. Let's leave. I hope you Thank you, Jelly Dirt, for another now, 10 tier ones. Thank you so Did you much. Just call the demon a motherfucker? No, I don't give a shit now. Oh, I'm done. shoot. I got my laptop. Oh, I got shoot. my holy water. I got the yep. card that I need here. Leave. Peace out. Leave. Bitch. Not leave. Even just a leave. Part leave. Of me feels bad about leave. 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 And I hate you. Leave, 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 leave. Thank you, Jelly Dirt, for the 10 tier ones. Thank you. Thank you, Dylan, for the 310 gifted subs this stream. Thank you so much. The Pikmin seem to believe it's a demon. Oh, no. Nothing I experience suggests otherwise. Leave, 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 leave. As always, the answer will remain unsolved. Of course it's unsolved. Oh. Man is sleeping. What's he doing? They're all sleeping. All right. Uh, what's going on? What's up? <laughs> oh, where are they going? Where are they going? Where are they going? Three days later. What happened three days later? It's been a couple days. Okay. We've got some time to recuperate. That's good. And actually, uh, get a gauge of what we saw. What, what did you see? Really, a lot to process. Yeah. You know, the first two locations, I wasn't sure. Yeah. My confidence was starting to waver, even at the last place, to yeah. like about halfway through. Yeah. But when that flashlight turned on, yeah. I think that's a proof positive. Ghosts and or demons are real. There's no other explanation <laughs> for it. No, I just think it was a, a wonderful coincidence. And I'm glad Shane, it happened. Shane, you dumb. to see you uh, turn into a babbling mess. Coincidence Oh, I see the sub goal chat. Thank you so much. Oh. He screwed the flashlight to right in between the on and off. Even if it's on the edge, like the very edge, it still needs. Yeah, it still needs a push. A little bit of a push. It still needs no, a push. Funny. You're you right, Shane. That push? Or Ryan. The the one ghost. of you. One Perhaps. of you guys. <laughs> Look, I'm happy to let you. Believe one of you guys. Because I think it's fun that you believe in it. Because if we go to more places, it's gonna be fun to watch you freak out some more. So, yep. Great. We're never gonna agree. Yep. Are demons and ghosts real? Can they influence people? Let's just call it unsolved. How about that? No, but we sure had fun. All right. Let's get out of here. They put their oh, drinks. Dear, oh, okay, good. Dear. Good. Thank you, Jelly Derp, for the 25 tier ones. Thank you again. Taking this with me, too. Yeah, take the candle. Yeah. Oh, 
I think you jellied it for another 10 tier ones. Um, I know that I said that I would do more one more, but well, that'll be the stream for today. I think you jellied it for the 10 tier ones. I'm just going to read out some subs and everything. So if you have a prime, um, now's the time to use it. I am not feeling too good. I would go longer if I did feel good tomorrow. I'm doing a stream. I'm going to be playing the game Layers of Fear. Um, apparently it's a good game. So yeah, thank you Kelsey for the prime. We're going to be keeping up the spooky thing um, by doing a stream sometime tomorrow. Um, playing the game Layers of Fear. So yeah, uh, thank you Nat for the Prime. Thank you Mint. Thank you Chaotic. Thank you um, Sheer. Thank you. Um, yeah, thank you guys. Thank you Amores. Um, thank you Twisty. Thank you guys. Thank you guys so much for all the subs and everything. It really does mean a lot that you guys are still supportive. Um, all of your subs goes to buying VHS equipment so I can make scary stuff. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Well, partly, kind of. I don't know. Um, thank you, Grace, for the five turns. Thank you. But yeah, I hope that you guys have a great rest of your night. Make sure you guys take care of yourself. Remember that you are safe. This is a show that is made for comedy. So remember that you're completely safe and you're completely okay. All right. Do one thing to take care of yourselves. All right. Do just one, one little thing. I want everyone to do at least one thing to take care of themselves. My taking care of myself thing will be refilling up my water bottle and drinking out of it. So do that. Um, make sure that you guys also subscribe to my new channel called Generation Loss. I tweeted it out on my alt. That will be where I'm posting the spooky stuff in a couple of months. So if you want to be one of the one of the original subscribers before there are any videos and subscribe to that. But um, thank you guys. Thank you guys for all the support today. Um, I'm, I'm glad that you guys enjoyed me watching other people be funny and occasionally trying to be funny myself. It really means a lot that you guys think that this is good content. Thank you. Um, thank you, Wyatt, for the prime as well. All right. I'll see you guys in the next stream, which will be tomorrow. All right. Bye bye. Bye bye, everyone. Bye bye. Uh...